Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome to today's stream. Welcome to Pipe Dreamers. Hope everyone's having a fantastic day. Very excited. So sorry for everyone that missed out on today's uh, Dead Beats. We had a cancel today because of last minute internet issues, and I want everyone on board before we continue on with Dead Beats. But good news is you guys get some more D&D with session two of Pipe Dreamers. So thank you guys again for being here and watching. I'll be thanking subs at the end of stream. But for now, I'd like to say hello to my lovely party. Man. Hi, everybody. <laughs> hey, man. Hi. Hey. How's it going? Well, we're just we're hung up on the ones we lost. was yelling at me for like the last like fucking 20 and minutes. And furthermore, <laughs> she killed <laughs> Samantha <laughs> without a name. <laughs> <laughs> now officially Samantha. Everyone has told me how much they miss Samantha. And I was Samantha. like, yeah, that was... Had a pretty dead, 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 dead. Yeah, I mean, all yeah. human, buff and dead. All human life is precious. It is because it's what what's really uh, what's really fun for me is when a player has a connection to an NPC, specifically their art, because that means I have to remove them from circulation of other NPCs that'll be like wandering around the city. You know what I mean? Oh, because no. otherwise uh -huh. everyone, people will know. Everyone so will your like, worst nightmare is us walking up to single random NPCs and being yes. like, you, you, come yeah. with me. Yeah. Let's go. And, on I, an and I'm like, okay. well, uh, well, I guess, I guess green, green haired Madame is now can, can never show is, her face. Is the and, guy from phase two ever coming back? Anywhere. No, never. Never. Damn it. Damn it. He's classic. <laughs> He's if, classic. If he does, if he does, I would make a big fucking deal out of it. You know what I mean? Like, he'd be wearing like Zeus's robes and it's still the same Fuck. face, same hair, and he just floats down. <laughs> It's just a secret boss somewhere around Clayberry is this guy just walking around. Oh god, like a fucking Elden Ring. It, it boss. really did make me yeah. calmer whenever he was around, like yeah, to be well, honest. Yeah, because you just were like, Nothing I'm gonna bad ever really happened around him. I'm in I'm it's in a nice. town. It was really good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So but uh yeah, Samantha's gone. And all green-haired ladies are now gone from. No. Uh, hey, whoa. Uh, yeah. Well, Damn, that man. that one in, in particular, I'm I'm gonna have to commission another one that ha looks nothing like <laughs> Samantha. Yeah, exactly. No. Not only do you kill these people, you kill my pocket. She was just slowly. my high five. Pal. <laughs> <laughs> She's not that important. Every time you add more more value to these these characters, it's just more value that it's like that I have to go to artists to be like, I need another green haired NPC that looks completely different. And they're like, I know why the price <laughs> just doubled. And I was like, damn it. All right, you got me, <laughs> shit. <laughs> they're gonna by start the DMing book. us to kill NPCs. So you have to hire Absolutely, them my God, that's, like a, hitman. that's a D&D. That's a D&D uh, &D <laughs> concept in itself, holy shit. All right, you guys ready to begin today's session? Dude, I Do can't I wait am for us to explode my character and reveal my real character. Yeah. Okay, all right. <laughs> yeah. Just every episode, I'm like, you guys, you guys aren't going to believe this. Tomato exploded again. I know. It was. Uh... No, but you know what? They would not expect a triple fake out. No one would expect a triple fake out. That's wild. I yeah. wish we had thought of it. I mean, honestly. Maybe we did. Who knows? Like, I, I mm. just at the end Good. of it, like every Nobody session. Nobody would ever see not it. Even coming. I did. Yeah, <laughs> like every after every session, chat and all the players are just like on edge that Tomatoes character is <laughs> just going to explode because I have nothing else creative to do. And I'm like, surely a fourth time wouldn't happen and i'm it like it wouldn't get old for like five or six times so like that's like a good five or six like you know backup plans oh for sessions God, oh God. Hmm. all right okay okay so let us begin with the burning bar just right just turn that up a little bit uh by the way uh one thing 
uh, another party mention in case you've been having some sound issues or if you've been turning down volume and then music has suddenly gotten really loud again. Uh, make sure you are turning down the volume from the global volume controls and not the music track itself. Because as, oh. I add, as I add new music tracks, you're still going to have that same level of, of yeah. loud. And uh, quite frankly, I'm busy DMing and I don't want to fix your problem. So you can just... <laughs> okay. This was a, this was a big... Maybe this you was, could just... just yeah, yeah, I respect that. I yeah, respect you know, that. here's the thing. I, I was like, this is a... This, I was like, that's a funny bit. And then I said it out loud and I was like, wow. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, it's, it's valid, dude. Hey, I got a question. Yeah, what's up? What's who's, up? Uh, who's Desperado? I keep seeing this on my <laughs> No, I don't want to talk about Desperado. it. I, we don't talk about Desperado. We do not. I don't want to bring Desperado <laughs> hey. in, in this game. We don't talk about Desperado. Oh Are we my supposed God. to be don't hearing about music Desperado. now? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes, yes, okay. you are. Um, are you not... Are you not here? No, I, you you DM. I'll I'll figure it out. No, no, fucking Lena. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh oh, you said that, and I was like, uh, no, 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 no. It was literally, and even after, like I said it as a joke, I I felt immediately like a piece of shit. Only to then add to the flavor when Tomato's like, I respect it, and I was like, oh no, man. Dude. Now I've no, got dude, you have to buckle dude, down you and gotta, get like more defensive. No. You gotta punch down at, at everyone, dude. That's you gotta. right. That's how you right. do it. That's no. Man. Don't let him ever try to get to your level. Punch him down. No, you really just have to assert your dominance. Uh, no, later. Do, do you need help? Oh, here now. Yeah. You figured it out. Okay, good. Awesome. Awesome. Sorry. Wait, you guys don't hear my shit, do you? Uh, my go XLR fucked this morning, so. No, I don't. I don't hear your shit. Okay. All right. Sweet. We're good. We're good. I'll I'll be adjusting everyone's volume. So if anyone's louder than anyone else, because it, it sounded like we all were having some, some audio issues. So now I felt bad saying being a piece of shit because there's literally two people I've never DM'd before, and I'm like, this is a great first impression. This is awesome. Great. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. He's a real tool, says new players. <laughs> new what the hell's up with this guy? <laughs> what the hell's up with this shit? Yeah. Lena's kind of loud. I turned Lena. I, down. I lowered my. Oh, okay. No, 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 you're good. You're good. no, no, you're good. No, you're good. You're good. You're good. You're good. Your, okay. audio, your audio is good. I got you. I got you on this side. Um, so where did we last leave? Oh, yeah, the uh, blow up bomb. The, yeah, the, this happened. Ah! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> I'm in no! there. No, your seafood tower. No, no, no. not the fish factory. No, the sewer strip. <laughs> uh, so, uh, today's session will begin right after. What happened with the first session, the old kobold, unfortunately burned down uh, from a what appeared to have been an explosive device that was within Talon's chest. Talon, of course. Well, no one really knows who Talon is, but it, he did appear to be a, a, a corpo man with the Xeon Corporation, if anyone were to assume his role. With dealings gone bad, uh, Zug and Drask, you guys were trying to get uh, a little a specific something from Talon, um, only to find out that you didn't have the money and Talon was tired of dealing with you. So he, uh, not that one led to another, but Talon definitely exploded and definitely blew up the old kobold. Within the two other survivors, uh, Fennec and Bo, you uh to join hey. hey oh hi Just, uh, hey you know popping in hey 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 it's me uh you hey. two uh <laughs> joined in drask and zug um Bo, of course after making sure that uh the dead were no longer burdened by their earthly possessions you all leave the burning bar to find uh that the streets itself empty and abandoned Individuals who fled from the bar that did survive immediately gunned down by what appeared to be uh, the uh, KDF, the Clayberry Defense Force, the Prot Force, the, 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 the essentially the law enforcement of the land. And uh, after trying to gather some information, Zug stepped forward 
yelling at these two, who then turned their guns to you all. You managed to, oh yeah, that's right. Uh, Blow his head off. <laughs> yeah, uh, Zug <laughs> built an, a, a fucking arm cannon, snapping the neck. So started blasting. <laughs> started blasting, snapping the neck of one of the officers. The other one flee, fled in terror. And now you all have continued to flee as well. But we're not done yet. Session two begins outside the burning wreckage of the old kobold, as you are now roaming the streets, unsure of who is friend or foe. But Zug, I believe you are attempting to bring people to a safe location that you know of. Is this correct? Correct. So I've got some good news and I've got some bad news. The good news is you're under the veil of darkness. And we do have a light here. That doesn't mean that you're shining bright like you're also on fire running through the city. The bad news is to reach this safe location, you'll have to travel all across Clayberry until you reach the Waste Yards, which is quite literally on the other side of town. Now, of course- Just a few blocks. Just a few blocks. Just a few. We will. But, but when you have- when you have the pr when you have prots uh, roaming the streets and apparently shooting people, you're not really certain. You're not really certain what's happened here. <laughs> Again, uh, you just witnessed. Oh, by the way, and that's also another key factor of note. Uh, Talon, who exploded, uh, reformed back into a gelatinous creature that seems to have the memory of someone who is only ten minutes. Ten minutes is that is that right, Tomato? Twenty-five minutes. Uh, Twenty-five seconds now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twenty-five <laughs> minutes. Twenty-seven. Uh, seconds years old. Uh, good news, though, is this unknown slimed individual, still named Five Question Mark, uh, had some meat before you left the uh, dirt in the burning bar during that encounter. So, uh, yeah, he's full. He's feeling pretty good. I'm not he's hungry, feeling, everyone. Not, not hungry. He's doing great. So, it's good manners. Instead of, uh, you know, just tell, you know, town portaling you guys over there. Uh, I've got some questions. So, Zug, you know where to go. Now, of course, you could travel the main streets, arrive at the Waste Yards pretty effectively and pretty quickly, but considering the fact that the KDF Prot Force quite literally turned their guns at you after gunning down an innocent person leaving the bar, it's safe to assume the streets might not necessarily be safe for your lot. Yes. So the question remains... Zug, leader of the party. What do you do? Mm -hmm. I'll say this as we're walking. Mm -hmm. I think we should cut through the fish factory. <laughs> the, the, the prats won't expect it. And I turn them left. I turn the party uh, left. <laughs> all right. You begin to travel across through the fish factory. Uh, the quickest way, of course, is through the, uh, the town circle, uh, past clockwork machina. But you're going through the fish factories and trying to dodge through with the uh, through the back through the back streets. Is that? Correct? Oh man, I thought we were like getting snacks. <laughs> we were just like, <laughs> like, eating a little pizza, we're to get some fucking snacks at the fish factory. <laughs> as you as you guys are dashing through the fish factory, you will notice one of the food carts that is selling. Uh, what is that delicacy with the fish on the sticks? And there's also the, like those 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 like. Uh, those doughy fish on the sticks as well. That's also like a like, like a an octopus or something. Ah, uh, fish sticks. Takayaki, yeah. So you've got takayaki. If you Ooh. also have oh. uh, like fi fish stick, yeah, fish sticks, fish fish kebabs. Um, one of the food carts outside the fish factory would be selling that. As you guys are like stealthily going through the streets, I can totally imagine Felsic just being like. Walking up to the food cart. <laughs> <laughs> I am pretty hungry. <laughs> and then she just immediately throws up because she's like a neurotic fucking chihuahua right now. <laughs> oh my I am, god. I am pretty hungry. She just wow. watched someone die. She's not used to that. She's we upset. have to keep moving. Come on. So Felsic, it, Felsic's on high alert, is what you're telling me. Yeah, she's not having a good time. Okay. What a whimsical way to store food matter. 
and then he's gonna start eating some of it. As we... I, I just I like put one paw out, and I just like as I'm walking, grab all of it as I go, and just put it in my bag for later. Wait, the, I'm like the, not anxious at all. The, wait, the food on the cart. Yeah, unless Felsec grabbed it all and vomited it, I guess I guess not. Are you are Felsic. you perch are you purchasing the food on the cart or are you just grabbing and going? Oh, I'm just I'm just grabbing and going. Like like imagine like the the cart. I'm watching really this all high, very carefully. And you can't see me. <laughs> no. All you can see is like this little paw on the top of the cart, right? Mm -hmm. And it's just like shuffling and I just like just nab some and then I I, I am copying going. them. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to copy have this. No morals. All right, so I'm gonna, right. I'm, just, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just drag Bo on this on the screen as well. Uh, Bo, give me a stealth check. Uh, okay, uh, okay, and run that, this through one more time. Is it's yeah, under skills. select your token and it'll be under skills. Yeah, you got it. So if you select your token, go to the upper left mouse over skills. Mm -hmm. You should see stealth. Got it. And then okay. click that. It will be a normal roll. Do I stealth as well? Oh yeah, absolutely. You are also oh. going to be joining in on this since you are watching Bo. Oh my God. So as you guys are walking <laughs> by, uh, Fal uh, I, I think Felsic getting sick. The uh, the shopkeeper would immediately walk up to Felsic. It's just like, oh, are, are you hurt? Are you all right? And then kneels down to Felsic. You know, hey, buddy, sick. I just had the worst IPA of my life. If I were you, I'd clear out of the streets. It's going to fucking stink. I'm sorry. No, no it's, uh, oh, oh. <laughs> like, <laughs> also, you should avoid the police. I don't think you have a license for this shit, right? Definitely avoid the police. All right, have a good one. <laughs> avoid the police. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, you guys would grab the food necessary. Uh, how much food are you grabbing? You successfully um, swipe the food. My character's grabbing until someone stops him. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, well, I don't, I don't want him to be stopped. So if he's copying what I'm doing, I'll just grab as much until I see, uh, the, the guy talking to Felsip come back and you know stash it in my bag, and I continue walking as if nothing happened. I don't know uh, how much this is. A lot, a good, a good, a good noticeable uh, amount. Uh, a good amount. All right, sounds good. So that's what happens. Um, you start grabbing uh, a good chunk of food, probably enough for a handful of meals. The uh, gelatinous creature also doing the same thing until eventually you said you stop them. Yeah, I think in, if I see you know him coming back, maybe I'll turn around and be like, hey, 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 Psst. Let's, let's keep going. Put put your shit away. Let's go. No, I don't want him to get caught. So if he, I stop, he stops. Uh, what is well. happening? <laughs> Shh. Hey Toots, don't worry about it. Let's keep going. I don't know what Toots is yet. You Toots, I Toots, they Toots, you Toots. Let's go. <laughs> you Toots, I Toots, they Toots. All right, so you also stop. All right. <laughs> God. All right. So needless to say, uh, you will go ahead and gather. Uh, let's see. How much are you gonna get? Go and gather. I'd say. Oh yeah, not pig. Uh, yeah, you, uh, you gather, uh, Jesus, you're like grabbing all this stuff. I'd say it down for four meals. So four meals. Easily, hey, easily, nice. easily two days worth of rations. The gelatinous creature also grabbing, but I, I think, uh, you're, you're swallowing. Is that correct? Are you consuming oh. <laughs> the food? There is no, there is no plan for storage. Yeah. Yeah. So you just kind of like <laughs> inhale the food itself. Uh, you will not be hungry for the next two days as your food <laughs> consumption is just dissolving and becoming more gelatinous matter. You don't have to, you never have to worry about like eating all the food and being like, I'm full. You just become more like as you, since you've oh. eaten literally two days worth of food, you'll actually notice Bo, since you're the one with this gelatin, this creature expands in size. Oh no! And becomes no, and becomes and becomes wider. Uh -oh. hey, he's growing. He's Why? growing, guys. What's happening? In fact, I think I'm just gonna see if I can just do that. Yeah. So you, uh, this yeah, you just you you just watch as <laughs> this gelatinous creature begins to expand in size. 
Oh god, what have I now, done? Now eating two days worth no. of food. He's gonna catamari the sitting. town. I keep this information in mind for later. Oh god! <laughs> Slightly larger. Christopher, no! Why are you getting smaller? <laughs> That's what's happening back there. I don't understand. Come on, we gotta keep moving. All right. Now you're getting, now they're getting much smaller. Yeah. Well, that's, yeah, that's because that's Bo's already small. Okay. So uh, you you pull everyone aside. You see your gelatinous friend now larger than before. You continue to run through Not the town. Not my friend. <laughs> your best friend. <laughs> All right. Thick as thieves. Um, <laughs> quite literally. Um, Zug, please roll yes. me. A stealth check. You may roll so at advantage, since you are cautiously exploring the town with the hopes to lead everyone to safety. <laughs> stealth. <laughs> Who does that? Not me. Uh oh. Eggs. <laughs> <laughs> he was never trying to be stealthy. How is that possible? <laughs> Wait, I don't know what that no the next roll was. I didn't that's, do that. Oh, that was me. Uh, but apparently, since I selected you, I rolled for you. So that's interesting. Perfect. Okay. So. You're just screaming at everyone. Hurry <laughs> Come up. on! I stop can't. getting fish! We have to go! <laughs> this way! The way we're traveling! Through the refineries and factories north of the Sclayberry Star Sea! Is this how we should be talking then? <laughs> Is this how we communicate outside? As you're running this <laughs> rather bulbous gelatinous creature, which clearly appears larger in size now, is screaming at you as flecks of slime <laughs> just, it just spray over your face. Uh, come on, we have to keep moving. What's not safe here? As you go through the refineries and factories, uh, you notice that while there are no prod around, you know this, Zug, that the factories themselves are kept watch uh, by uh, several security guards. You are free to roam the streets or roam around. They only get especially protective if you go through them. You're uncertain of what is in the factories, um, but you have had plans. Not plans, but uh, potential plottings to maybe infiltrate them in the future, if necessary, for a special project that you've been working on. You make note of the security officials that roam around the area. Please give me another stealth check. Again, <laughs> at advantage. Hey, Brett, as wow. we're traveling, yes. uh, would would you say that at the fish factory when I ate, I healed a little bit more? <laughs> Just checking uh, because I did eat at like the tavern and healed and like you one did health heal, point. That is correct. The reason why you healed for that is because you had literally just came back to life and blew. And okay, just just wanted yeah. to make sure because I'm like I'm I'm still yeah. That's not, to, that's not that's, that's not a trait. Yeah, that's not a trait okay. that you get. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, and you'll continue to go through the refineries. Uh, you are approaching a main street, uh, but where would you like to go now, Doug? I consult brother. What do you think's best? We should definitely avoid the clockwork machina. But uh, the market or the vaults? Well, how far do you think the explosion could be heard from? I don't know. It was pretty high explosive device. A few city blocks, maybe. Uh, probably heard it at the embassy, but not much farther. I think the market might have eyes. The alley south of it might be good, though. If you would like further uh, musings, I suppose, you both are free to roll an intelligence check. Uh oh. Hey, I can do that one. Yeah. How, how do you. Uh, when, you select, when you select, you can go to, <laughs> I believe, checks. You mouse over ah, checks. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Drask got a five. Drask has nothing to add. Zug, <laughs> you do theorize Brain. a couple of things. The farther that you get away, you do believe that would lead you to mm, safer. Because again, sound travels, and they'd probably, their prots would probably be investigating the old kobold, the site itself, not so far away from it. 
but it doesn't hurt to be extra careful. You are correct that north is the Clockwork Machina and also the main streets, which is definitely not where you'd want to go if you're trying to keep out of the watchful eye of the KDF. Through the small market itself could potentially be a little bit quieter. However, because markets and stalls and shops and many valuables are here during the evening hours, there would probably be a small prot shop or probably a, a small prot watch and probably enhanced security that would not be anywhere else. The Vodium, the Voidium vaults, however, does take you to Void Town. And since that's more of like a junkyard area itself, it would probably not have as much security as the rest of them. But it would mean farther travel. We can survive a little extra travel time. I don't mind the walk. Yeah, so um, cut, right. cut yeah, through the vaults. Well. I have a question. I ate a lot. I'm tired. My feet hurt. Uh, is it mm -hmm. possible to check if I can can travel inside the gelatinous mass? Like I want to, I want to, <laughs> I want to see if I can just hang I out saw what inside. Happened to the fish, right? Like inside the gelatinous yeah, mass, yeah. or on Maybe the gelatinous just, mass? No, in, I, I've tried on top, but he just turns into a puddle. I want to go inside. Okay. I'm gonna give the raccoon a straw <laughs> to breathe out of. I want to reach inside and I want to hmm. stay in there. And I, my brain says maybe I'll float inside this gelatinous mass, and I don't have to walk. One moment, please. What okay. is happening? <laughs> Let's hang on. See I want to see something. See the best part about. Tomato's characters. I don't know if it's Tomato yelling it or the creature <laughs> yelling it. That was a uh, bit of both. That yeah, was a bit of both. You know, I'm All doing right. The so same. as this hefty, hefty gelatinous creature is just sliming around, uh, Bo <laughs> will immediately begin to crawl. Uh, gelatinous hey. creature, do you let Bo just go into you, or would you try uh, to resist this? As you start to go into the gelatinous dig, creature, you're going to dig. feel your hands start to burn. Yes, that is correct. Uh, a little bit dissolving. A little bit of dissolving. Your hands might be going a little bit bald, maybe. Uh, my fur is like singeing off my paw a little bit, and I like retract it really quickly. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, I guess I ain't doing that. <laughs> All right, then. That's it. Are Next you food then? <laughs> no, not food. Are you I was literally gonna have you roll constitution save says <laughs> literally this acidic creature starts eating you alive. Oh <laughs> man. Okay. So you hear Sug, as you and your brother are contemplating this, you hear this argument from behind you, where the rackling attempts to dig into the correct creature. You begin to see the steaming of an ex of a familiar acidic burn on the paw of Bo. I just sit there with my hands out going, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> well, well, what is it? Uh, so with that, you'll take the uh, longer route. Is that correct? Yes. All right. You continue to travel across the factories and warehouses. Again, keep in mind that there is a, a, a small security force in both areas. You do take note, since you're by the Clayberry Star Seaport, the warehouses over here have heavier security. Fortunately, you will not be diving through there. As you continue across the open area past the railway service station and into the, vo uh, the, Vodium, the, the Voidium area, Trying to avoid the vaults itself, because again, all of this area is heavily protected. You begin to travel through Void Town. This place functions as sort of a uh, a larger junkyard. As mentioned before, the Void Yards is specifically used to condense down uh, larger objects into smaller things instead of just disposing it. Or as some uh, not so smart uh, people have as just simply stated, push the garbage off the side of the island and let it float, <laughs> let it float away in space. <laughs> Which would lead to very much long-term, long-term, uh, long-term consequences. I think we should put them in tubes uh, and shoot it towards the core of the planet. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's, that's also a thing. But right now, before actual study is done, uh, everything is condensed and placed in the Voidium vaults. You travel through the Void Yards, I need everyone to roll a perception check, please. All right. 
Hmm. I'm perceiving. Ooh. Uh. Yes. Yo, I'm not super used to using foundry yet. Oh yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. So if you go, do you know where your character is? Um. So you know, like how Roll Twenty has, like, you know, mm -hmm. where your character journal is. You're gonna be doing the same thing. Go ahead and select the third tab in the upper right corner and go into okay. you Pipe Dreamers players okay. and then you okay. see your character. I, I found it. I found it, I think. You got it. You got uh, it. Wait, but last time I swear either. there was like a bunch of these like macro buttons that were like- There was, yeah. when, you select yeah, your, when you select your token, but your token's currently not out in the field. Oh, you're right. You're right, you're right. My bad, my bad, my bad. You good? Wait, so if the token's not in the field, how do we do a roll? Uh, you would go through your journal. And the third tab. It'd be the third in the tab players. in the upper right corner in Pipe Dreamers. Upper. Hey, oh. I see nothing. Journal entries? I see everything. Uh, no, so in the third tab, it looks like three little actors. Like oh, three yeah? Little, Pipe little Dreamers? Icons. Yeah, Pipe Dreamers, and then and the players folder, you should see your character. Double click uh -huh. that, and that'll load your character. Sheet. Oh, pressing C also, does, that's nice. Oh, yeah, someone oh, also then, mentioned then, this. If you press C, and then it, just. It immediately opens your character sheet. I apologize. We learned that uh, Tuesday. Yeah, yes. and then just go to your go to your skills, and then just click on perception. It'll just yeah. roll it in the attributes. It'll tab. say like roll normal oh. advantage, just advantage. Yeah. Yeah, I forgot you can just press C. I have no clue what Tam Toe is. Ooh. Same. Yeah, I don't know, man. I guess <laughs> Bo and I are just playing patty cake or some shit. <laughs> uh, my character is just patty staring cake. at. Bo <laughs> trying to f decipher whether or not it should continue to try to eat them <laughs> afterwards. You got a taste. Uh, uh. While this is happening, Drask, you'll hear a low roar from the void yards. The roar appears to be, I forget what the scientific term is. It sounds like a big old bear. Is there supposed Ooh. to be bears around here? Nope. Uh, Come on, Warren, let's just keep moving. More, it's just a void bear. I'm, but, but more importantly... <laughs> it's just a void bear? <laughs> Zug, what you doing? Z Zug, I have to say Zug suddenly I gets wanna, deja vu. I want to punch the void bear. It's kind of like nope. a forest nope. here. What is a void bear? <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> um, no, uh, but the, uh, the, the roar itself almost sounds reflected. Almost as if it was in some sort of like, it it kind of sounds like it's from in like a steel box of some sort. Uh, Ooh. Like it's a distorted roar, but it's very it. low and echoes off. Where's it coming from? Hey, thoughts come over here. Let's go look. And I Bo, like Bo, try to. Let's not do that. <laughs> Bo, you did not. You you did not hear it. No one did. <gasps> Only Rask. I did. Ah, what? Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. Zug sidebar. <laughs> Zug sidebar. <laughs> I don't know why I shuffle over. So I shuffle over to the side. Yeah. <laughs> I think there's a bear in the void yards locked up right now. <laughs> what are you talking about? I, I, you didn't hear it? <laughs> no, what it, you're you're so stupid. We're trying to get to home right now. <laughs> oh. I love such. <laughs> Where are you trying to get back? Oh, he has a point. Once once he drops down, I kind of want to see what that was and why it's there. Okay, we'll, we'll put a pin in it. Yeah. <laughs> put a pin in the void bear. What are you talking about? Sorry, anyways. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Killed me. <laughs> this is uh, my wacky orc voice. I could have yeah, done like the, the deep like full. I like orc it. Voice. I like it. It's I, it's. I, I think it fits. It's I think it fits. I like peon well. voice a lot more. Yeah. So, uh, do you continue? You, you continue to leave Void Town? Is that correct? Yeah. <gasps> we'll head uh, north from here. I think. And yes, you will. We're almost home free. You are. Can I? Can, mm -hmm. can I pick up some of the like? gunk in the center before you know I'm, I'm like trailing along the back Zug's trying to walk away I want, I want to pick up that gunk and I want to can I can I put it in the, the gelatinous mass I just what want to do start you, what trying do you mean? so oh, what, so is, is this your science experiment <laughs> listen so, so 
as you're leaving, the Void Yards itself isn't just like leans down, picks up, throws. The Void Yards is probably about. Mm, hold on. There's actually. Uh, I need. I need. I need a metric convert. Actually, fuck. I'm, I'm gonna say it's about 100 feet away. So you'd have to scurry out to the Void Yards, and the Void Yards itself is just kind of looks like dissolved away refuse, like dissolved away garbage. Is that mm -hmm. what you would do? You just kind of like scurry off for a second, like you run go over. skate over there. Yeah, I want to just pick up whatever's closest to us because there's okay. like some pick up as you, as you scurry away. Uh, my character will ask the group, "Is it okay for me to eat the hairy child?" <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it, it's not. Stop right my there. My ears, like <laughs> my ears, start to flutter, and I look and I like grab the closest mass of gunk, and I just. I just grab two of my paws and I shove it in his stomach. All right, so as fast you as I can. So as uh, as Bo scurries off into the junk, uh, returns back over to the gelatinous creature. Uh, you see this, by the way, just holding on like two dissolved chunks of refuse, and it appears as if Bo's about to shove it into you. <laughs> gelatinous creature, how do you respond? What is happening? So you just let it happen? You just kind of like get, get <laughs> The character it. looks to the others and asks what is happening. He was just told he's not allowed to eat this thing, but <laughs> you know he's trying to push stuff into it. You know what? Uh, Maybe you're, you are back on limits. <laughs> uh, so as the as the eaten material gets shoved into you, I need you to make a constitution saving throw. Uh-oh. Uh, this, this, this is for the gelatinous creature. Okay. Where is my... I'm looking at my journal. I don't see my... So when you press oh, C, uh, yeah, it. yeah it'll uh, 14. be. Okay, cool. All right. So with a 14, your body instinctively takes the material as you will then see, you all see the gelatinous creature sort of warble about. <laughs> Just vibrating a little bit until <laughs> suddenly a mouth, a maw opens in the no. in the coat where the <gasps> chest is spewing out uh the Ugh. void matter as well as other just chunks of dissolved I'd like to food. aim at Bo's face. <laughs> <laughs> you do so as it just spews all over. Uh <laughs> gelatinous we creature learn, shrinks down in size. 2 days full now becomes 1 day full. No. I'm just going to stand there giggling, but like kind of wiping it off my eyeballs. You reek, Bo. <laughs> uh, that's okay. It smells kind of good. What are you doing? Narrator <laughs> note, it didn't. I don't know. I kind of like the smell. <laughs> yeah, but why are you pushing things inside of him? Why are you not? I mean, I did want to see what if, would happen. If the hairy baby pushes one more thing inside of me, I will eat them. You know what? I wouldn't even blame you. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. I'll keep that in mind for later, but I do want to see what else goes inside there. Let's get, we can shove point. things in them when we're home. Okay. <laughs> 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 yeah. All right. Good thinking, Travis. <laughs> <laughs> right on. <laughs> um. <clears throat> so you'll arrive back home, sweet home, over to your waste yards. The waste yards itself, as you take note, also has its own smithies and workshops and factories. But this area is more comfortable. You're aware of the threats that exist here. As you all walk into uh, what was once a loading dock of an abandoned, condemned factory building. Uh, Zug, you approach the loading dock, kind of open the shard panel, which seems to have been exposed for a, long, a, a while. It, it's like ex open exposed, like wires and pieces of shard crystal is there. Taking your tools with a smile you just sort of like jam a screwdriver into that one <laughs> spot that you know exactly how it works 
as the loading dock that you're all standing in descends down underground, or rather underneath the condemned factory. Now louding. Now louding. Now louding, louding the Zugyard. Oh, yeah, baby! Ooh. We're home. Uh, yeah. Can I just, like, start to, like, kind of run around in that general area we're in and just start, like, wiping my face on the carpet or the floor? Yeah, absolutely. You begin to wipe your <laughs> face right. on the factory masonry floor. Yep. I'm doing it. It's not entirely worse than it are. Yeah, it's already pretty smudged with <laughs> dirt. You don't take care of this place, and huh? oil box. Oh, absolutely not. I mean, you guys have been, you guys are scrapping. As you guys walk in, uh, as you, as you guys walk in, you just see a bunch of refuse junk scattered all around this area as it appears to be the floor of a factory. Stairs are sent down and, uh, are sent up to offices and uh, a meeting room. If you have any questions, let me know, but you're free to walk around and do whatever it is you wish. We should be safe here for a while. Hey, uh, I don't want to be a downer. I know we just watched like 12 people die. So I guess like more of a downer, but you guys like know what this means, right? What does this mean? Like, we just saw something we absolutely weren't supposed to see. We killed a cop and they know what we look like we're safe here but like honestly i think we should go to a different fucking country or some shit or underground how about a different planet hey 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 you know, get off yeah you know you know you know what if we had the <laughs> means i'd get off the whole fucking planet uh you I don't know <laughs> what i did wrong You'll see Zug walk up and start screaming over at the rackling that's scrambling about this big chunk of uh, this big chunk of metal that appears to be some sort of hall. You, uh, you don't touch that. That is mine. Bo, you are I'm being yelled like, at. It's not finished uh, yet. Hey, I, I like this, uh, this, this chair. It's pretty comfy. I can give you the chair. Get off the big... <laughs> My project. Hey, is is it really tall? Like, do you have to like how did I like do you have to oh, jump yeah. down? Oh yeah, it, it's thing? literally like 15 feet up in the air. You literally had to climb up, uh, up sections of metal before you got back up there. You can jump down safely though. Hey, Zugs, open your arms. Zugs, baby, come get come me. On, come on, come on, come on. A little bit wider. Come on. What? Just make the jump. Oh. I don't catch. <laughs> oh no! Hey! Wow. I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> I was just about to roll the folly, damn it. No, no. <laughs> oh my god. I will attempt to catch. You catch, you catch. Okay, okay. He catches me, but he's got like sludge and gunk all over his hands now. He stinks. No. I wipe it off on pant. Okay. Don't go on there. <laughs> everything else is okay. Well, not everything. In fact, don't touch most things. But uh, especially don't touch that thing. Is, okay. is, uh, is this your is this your baby? Yeah, this is this is her. <laughs> Fuck man, how long you been working on this thing? How far you got? Well, I've got most of the pieces here. I just haven't really thought of a good way to put it all together. Also, uh, missing a few key components, so we're not getting anywhere any time. Hey, hey, get yeah, off of there. there. I want to get back on there. This is why up, I'm being yelled at. Because you were on a space you should not be. That is my space, Zug space. You get okay. off. Is this better? What? <laughs> no, the whole... The whole assembly! Don't you understand? God, he's so smart. I don't understand. <laughs> I keep this telling you all this. <clears throat> Can I like scurry back up there? I'm, I'm gonna, I'm scurrying. I'm scurrying and I'm here. You're, You're making to, it worse. You're free to do whatever you want. 
Are there any cracks in the ground, Brett? Like this isn't oh, perfect I mean, it's fucking all construction. Open paneling. Yeah, you're free He's to do whatever you want. He's seeping into the ground right now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> He's like seeping into the ship without realizing. <laughs> all right, no. I'm climbing up. There he goes. Hey, Zugs, I'm, I don't know what happened. I'm just going to attempt to just move him away before he seeps into any more cracks. Uh, there are is, is literally all that remains is just gelatinous fragments of the crack that he's currently in. As he is as flat as he could possibly be. Please, please. Can we like sweep the rest of him off? I'm going to start jumping on it. I'm jumping on top of the space. You are jump in the cracks. You're quite literally just jumping on a panel at this point in time, going as your little as your little rackling feet are going <laughs> scratching on the on the ceiling. If you come out, I'll give you a fish. <laughs> All right. And he comes out. <laughs> he, pop, he pops out. With That's a, more like it. <laughs> I I don't like this, but. Everyone get off. I'll try to hey, shoo everyone off. Open your arms. Let me in there. I'm assuming you just sort of like drag me along. Yes. I, I grabbed yeah, your Yeah, yeah, yeah. She, she, she. <laughs> I'm ready. Come here, toots. Let me at him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Woo! You land. I, I land, but like both my, my paws are like, you know. Hanging in uh, maybe a place they shouldn't be, and I'm like, oh, don't say! <laughs> Did we just do? What? <laughs> Did we just? <laughs> this is our fall. You got me. Just, what, what do I say? Is this is our first fucking anime groping scene. <laughs> I, 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 I think this is my first anime groping scene in any D and D game I've done. It's 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 ever if, ever it's, yeah. it's fine if it's Lena Uwu. Uwu yeah. That's hey, ever. Not, say not thanks, true, uh... Brett. Not true. No. There was oh. the, there was the first one. Remember? Oh. oh. What? Remember? No. No. <laughs> what? <laughs> you don't remember? I it don't. Was fucking session one. Oh, it was oh session my one. god! You're right. You're right. You're right. Oh shit. Oh my god. You're right. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> yep. 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 That was that. Yep. 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 Can't talk about that. Can't talk about that. I was like, I'm we just gonna totally stay can. here until you put me it's... down. No, it's it's fine. I'm. No, it's you can stay here. It's fine. Oh, her arms okay, are just fucking hang locked, up, bit. locked up around this wreck. <laughs> it's, fluffy. it's like a teddy bear. Here. It's like a, like a, like a, like a, a jaded New York man, but a teddy bear, and that's yeah. perfect. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So I'm getting a drink. Okie dokie. Okay, let's all just think about what we should do. <laughs> yeah, I mean, we can't exactly call I, the cops, right? I sit down like, on the floor, cross-legged, and just don't talk to anyone. It's been an hour since I was alive. Slime, you want a drink? Yeah, happy birthday, buddy. What is that? Come on, I'll put this in you. <laughs> is he talking to you or me? You, Slime. You, you, you are Slime. I'm not Slime. All right. He leaves like a fucking full on stain, like a slime, like <laughs> rail all the way along all this wood. <sighs> uh, one moment, please. As I've uh, heard this said a couple of times, I have to uh, make a change. Uh oh. Uh oh. Now, of course, this can change uh, as time goes on, but for now. All right, there we go. <clears throat> okay, change has been made on screen. Instead of tomato slash question mark, question mark, question mark. Uh, this creature has heard its name <laughs> being identified as slime. Can you add a like an, an extra part where I respond to any other kind of identification? Just yeah, to absolutely, I'm absolutely. Him David. Yeah, because yeah. I, I specifically responded because I checked with everyone else first. No, no, it's all good. It's all good. And just for now, <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna write slime down there. That'll change as it as it goes on. Yeah. All right, open your uh mouth. What? 
Do you have an orifice? What's an orifice? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna pour a drink on his head. See what happens. Uh, this alcoholic fluid just just dot yeah just goes it just goes into you as the fluid itself gets to me uh, melts into your acidic form. You do not gain any sustenance from this whatsoever. Uh, how do you feel? Do I clock that there's alcohol in it, like poison? Ah, uh, no, you would not. And the reason okay. why is because your acidic form uh, prevents you to be intoxicated by simple beers. I think nice. if I feed you enough of this, you'll be flammable, yeah? Sure. I can just light you up. You, you're like a, a bomb too. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Zog, I think I got a weapon. We all have weapons. No, but like we could blow this thing up again. No, not to. in here. No, not in here. I've oh, never okay. blown up though. <laughs> not yet. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna down my drink and then hop over the bar. Over to Zug. All right, bye. <laughs> As you walk away, uh, the slime creature just sinks into the bar stool. He is going to go over that bar counter and start just trying to follow his instructions and start drinking all this alcohol. Like he oh, said. No. All right. Whether As you guys notice or not, I'm clearing out the bar. I'm turned away. Oh, boy. <laughs> Shit. Uh, stress at, at first, I, I'll think he's just making himself a drink. Not really think too much about it. <laughs> I think I'm making myself a drink. <laughs> at first, he's, as he rummages through all these things, I'm just like, this guy's like very wood generous. cracking and stuff as he breaks <laughs> open barrels. You ever watch that 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 scene in uh in uh what is it uh uh Spirited Away, where No Face is just devouring yeah. all the food <laughs> and expanding. <laughs> Yeah, that's what's happening to the slime creature right now as they're just expanding their mouth on like various faucets and kegs that have been placed here and gathered for quite some time. The slime creature now consuming everything they possibly can. Is he making like a big mess or anything or? I, I mean, there is a mess. There, there's no mess being made right all currently. In him. Okay. Uh, what's happening over here? I'm, I'm looking in Zug's face, his thinking face. I could tell when he's deep I'm, in thought, and I don't want I'm to in, distract I'm him. I'm deep in thought, and then I you know. slowly start leaning backwards. I'm cross-legged right now, and just start leaning backwards. And then I roll okay. onto my back. Okay, Bo like runs over there while he's on his back and just climbs onto his belly. And sits, just like does, plops his butt down, and his feet are sitting up. I'm just kind of like sitting there, waggling my tail, and looking at him. What hey, if... You okay, Dots? What's going on? Uh, don't, don't, don't distract him. Thinking hey. about if we. He's in the zone. Yeah. But then. <sighs> He's like silently thinking, and I reach down with my tiny oh, paw. Buddy. You one pointed it. finger and I slowly reach in and I put a little bit of my finger in his nose. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll go shut say, wake up. Uh, I'm what thinking. are we doing? Uh, well, I'm just trying to follow. I think I agree with Felsick. We should try Wait, to we seriously we have to like i know we're all just like chilling and like having drinks or whatever but we have to like go underground or get we the fuck out of this country yeah. <laughs> like deeper like we need to build burrows like we're rabbits or there's something a shovel like, in the there's corner. no getting away from this you know what that's a really good idea zug and she's gonna go grab I... a shovel and start digging <laughs> Okay. Felsic goes into a all pile. And in looks, my next life. It starts looking for a shovel. I like put my nose in the air and I start sniffing. I'm like, I smell so something going on over here. As Bo, re as Bo returns to the bar, you hear the snapping of the bar breaking in half. <laughs> Huh? Slime creature, what? you've consumed all the alcohol in that corner. 
Oh, dang. Oh, nice. Good for him. Hey, no, 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 Happy birthday. Happy birthday, little man. He looks so you, are, you are more, <laughs> you, you're kind of like, you're the consistency of like a giant water balloon now. So as you move around, you just sort of jiggle from left to right. Why did you do that? Picking up the barrels, shaking them, realizing they're all empty. They're all I was under no, the impression no. this is what that one wanted. Points it's over really the hard. To, it's really hard to find booze. Oh, that was months of storage. You think we can make him throw it up? Yeah, yeah, throw it up. <laughs> oh, that's I got this. Hey, I don't stick your think hand. So. You got. You still got the goo on you. Stick your hand in him. Uh. Do I still have a little bit of goop like in my bag? Or Am something? I allowed to eat this nope. one if it comes near me? <laughs> Don't eat it. Can uh, I get have, like you, you have no more goop on you, unfortunately, as you use there, like, all of it to box? thrust to, into it. But wait, you're just opening the box. You just open the box to see various sort assortments of just scrap metal and parts. Can I just grab like like a, a raccoon's paw full of scrap? Yep. And like it <laughs> trails behind me. Yep. I'm running as fast as I can. Can yep. I just can I shove it in him? I, yeah, if it. No, if, I would try, I would grab her hand before she does. If, if I you can, put if, if you text. submerge any part of your hand near this creature right now, it is going to actively attempt to eat you. Okay, can I like? I am letting you know because I will expect <laughs> you to make a save because yeah. I will be making rolls. <laughs> I'm also trying to grab the little paw before it goes uh, in. First things first, uh, Drask, uh, go ahead and make an athletics check for a grapple. Bo, you can go ahead and make an athletics oh. or acrobatics check to break out of the grapple, as you now see creatures actively trying to stop you. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. As you kind of dive in, uh, Drask grabs hold of you. Stopping it's more of a, we both sort of just fumbled and my fumbling hit the hand. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we, okay, that's enough. We need these parts. Do not feed it. Well, how is you gonna make him throw up the stuff? It's I, fine, it's fine. We'll find oh. more. Oh. I don't know what I did we'll wrong. You consumed all of our alcohol. I forgot to tell him not to drink I was fed some anymore. and then told to drink it more of it. I did not say that. I believe you implied that you wanted to oh, turn me into a bomb again. Oh, yeah, but... Oh, okay, I see. <laughs> I see, That's I see. funny. <laughs> Something is, like, five feet underground at this point. Like, her head is sticking up above the dirt. And she's just oh, yeah. Like, Let's there's, on like, a mound of dirt behind her. Oh, yeah, you'd be digging over here where there's actual dirt as a small uh, tunnel uh, is now being dug. Uh-huh. She's yeah, out. You're She's digging. out. You're She's like dipping. five feet down. Yeah, you're digging currently. I I'm don't, just gonna watch her. I don't know if digging is our solution. Hey, Why trash, would you uh, dig it when uh, you could simply slide into a small crack and escape? <sighs> what are well, we what's doing? What's your bright idea, Zug? Like, I'm, I'm, at, I'm out of options here, dude. I've never been a fugitive before. <laughs> You need come to calm man. down. You have to gonna, throw I'm me gonna, a rope or something. I'm gonna come to this little campfire I got here. Yep. And uh, and spark that bad boy up. You'll uh, see he reaches his arm out and this uh, pipe uh, protruding from the side of it, like on the top of his arm, uh -huh. uh, lights up and sparks a bit and and a little bit of flame comes out of it and he just lights the, the campfire with this like flamethrower arm. You illuminate the campfire as it provides now a lovely little flickering light Whoa. source. Oh, do it. Do we tell okay. him so? I love Foundry. <laughs> Me too. You think we should? I mean, I th I don't think we have a choice right now. Mm. I can't leave them here. Okay. Okay, okay. Yeah. Yes. It is okay with me, brother. What is it? I, I don't know the technicals. I don't know what even that thing is called. So. A vessel? A ship? Maybe you should. Uh, ship? Vessel? Is it? Right now? Will oh it be? No, right now it's, it's a pile of junk. So we all, uh, we want to get off this place, yeah? 
looking. Huh? Oh, are you in the hole still? Yeah, she was like, she was walking, like, you're up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Why the rest of shit? What about you, Bo? Huh? You're huh? not gonna get away right now? I don't think oh, we can stay here. There's something or someone after us, yeah? Really? I feel like that trade was a setup. You know, I got a, I got a small inkling of a thought that it was. Hmm. Why would, who would try that? Who you, would do that? <laughs> Wait, do you think it was Graven? Graven Kiv? Yes, <laughs> above board, whoops. <laughs> <laughs> only, 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 uh, only Zug knows Graven. Uh, since Jurassic, I'm assuming is not familiar a lot with names. Zug lays down in thinking mode again. Mm. He's Yo, one of the like security gonna... officers of the oh, void shit. yards. We, we were working out a deal, but I don't think he'd go this far. He doesn't really I'm... like me, but. What if someone else is paying him more? Hmm. Maybe we should talk to him. You know, this might just be big misunderstanding. Yeah, I can see that. Okay. Well, let's rest here for a while. Let let the heat cool down, literally, from the old cold. From the explosion. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Question. Huh? If we are trying to get the heat to cool down, why did you light a fire? Uh, uh, you, you take things too literally. Also, Yo, I'll take, Oh, go ahead. Sticks her head out of the out from underground and spits out a mouthful of dirt. Yo, Zug, oh. you think somebody set us up? Is that what you're saying? That's what Drask is saying. I, I, I don't know. I mean, why else would somebody blow up after trying to make a trade? for a very expensive part that was stolen, <laughs> well, yes? On. I don't think he wanted to blow up. <laughs> I don't think it matters if he wanted to blow up. What if someone else wanted him to blow up, to blow us up oh my for God. trying to get a part that they had that they <sighs> didn't want to sell? Whoa. Man, all I'm saying is that if we know the person who might have done this, we need to go talk to them or say something to them to like get them off our back because otherwise we're just fucked. Yeah, I, I agree. Like, our lives are over. Like, y'all understand this, right? Okay. I'm, I'm, okay. I'm building my new doubt. life down here. And <laughs> she keeps digging. I was like, it's going to be okay. Come come to the fire. <laughs> okay, fine. Come over. Come over. It's okay. Hey, maybe I'll we shouldn't have this thing this. near the fire, yeah? I think oh. it's like 80% alcohol at this point. Well, to be honest, I'm turning into a bomb. <laughs> I'm not very attached to it. This the slime thing. I, I honestly, that's the only puzzle piece that I can't solve right now. What yeah, I do still don't do know why. It? Why was he in Talon to begin with? So I take it Talon was my predecessor then. Yes. If that's what the thing that you blew up was, yes. And you came to make a trade with Talon. That is correct. And he blew up. Yes. Well, I don't know what's going on. I was really hoping you would just keep going and you were, that's, that's, you were realizing something and Epiphany was about to- That's really know. insightful. Hang on, that's let really me insightful. think. Well, thank you. <laughs> uh, as, <laughs> as the slime thinks, you hear a, the sound of a, like a pop as if a ship sprung a leak. Uh, slimy alcohol begins to stream out of the back of uh, of, the sl of the slimy creature. Aw, oh, dang. I start like sniffing. <laughs> back up. And I put like my whole nose, like my nostrils, both of them are like flat on the ground, sniffing out the slime alcohol situation. It's sickening. Like to me or to everyone else? Uh, to, to you who's putting your nose like in, in the area. Okay. I make like a, like a gagging noise and I like slowly take my nose. Taste it. Is it strong? 
Uh, uh, uh. I like back Sounds up like towards. it is. <laughs> we made a cocktail. <laughs> I don't think the bomb plan is going to work anymore. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna go behind him and stick my finger in it and then put my finger in my mouth. <laughs> Make a constitution saving throw. Yeah. Oh my god. Okay, maybe, <laughs> right maybe on. It's a, maybe it's a. <laughs> um, okay. I'm just gonna go ahead and roll this. All right. Grass, you take four points of acid damage as you consume <gasps> raw acid. It's either really good or really bad. <laughs> Rast is currently at two hit points. <laughs> okay. Yo. Okay, enough. Nice. Let's, the let's slime keep man. like eating the slime guy, I guess. <laughs> no more touchy slime man. Okay. Can we all agree on that? Yeah. Yeah. Come on, guys. Yeah. We got like, please. We gotta get it together here. <laughs> uh, uh. Listen, we're all pretty worse for wear. We can spend the night here. Uh, we got some rooms over on the left side. Point. All right. Uh, yeah. Let's 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 pack it up. Uh, tomorrow morning, what we're, we're gonna go talk to your friend Zug, the one who might have set us up. Friend is generous. Okay. But, uh, your yeah. nemesis. More like just nemesis someone that exists. Generous. Uh, someone that exists the same time as us somewhere else. It's really. More like. It's He's there. Someone who you have like profound Business erotic contact. tension with. Uh -huh. Okay. Same thing. Mm -hmm. Got it. And Bo, like, obviously look like he's not paying attention to anything at all. And he kind of, like, shakily walks towards this thing. Mm -hmm. And he puts his paws on it, and he yells out, Hey, Tutsis! What is this? It's gonna take us... Oh, I mean, never mind. Ugh. Nothing. Yo, uh, what, what was that first thing you said? Uh, Say nothing. Again. Hey, speak up. No I'm one like, can no, you my speak down. Tell them. <laughs> Don't be talking like this again. H how far away am I? I? I just assumed I was kind of far. Uh, you are that many. Feet. You're 40, 40 feet, away. feet away. That's a good amount. Yelling. No. I'm like still rubbing my paws all over this thing. No, don't touch I'm just that. Touching it. I continue uh. to touch it more the more he tells me not to touch it. I start storming over. Hey, what hey. is this thing? It's my thing is what it is. It's none of your business. We're all going to have to go on it anyways. We need to tell them at some point. Otherwise, they're going to be kind of surprised when it does what it needs to. Yeah. I put my nose on the, on the on the contraption. Okay. Okay, come back to the fire. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you. Okay. <laughs> okay, kick scrap. <laughs> Don't kick that. <laughs> Okay, here's the real deal. That thing over there, I know it doesn't look like much. You, you look over and it literally looks like a rusty playground. It looks nothing <laughs> like anything. The pile uh, of garbage. <laughs> no, that is the Mark I. And he looks around and holds his hands out like jazz hands and like seeing if anyone likes that. <laughs> the Mark I. Hey, Opa. Yeah. What? It's huh? a vessel. It's a ship. Don't you see? <laughs> that bad boy is going to fly us out of here. Hey. Fly? What? Yes. Shit, I'm... Zog, you're building a spaceship down here? Mm, That's what you've been generous. working on, buddy? Space is generous. Um, space is generous. Okay. <laughs> space I might generous. be able to get it to run. I'm just missing some parts and also assembling it and also designing it. It has a lot of holes. Those will get patched. Those will get patched. What do you think all this scrap's for? Okay. So, I really have been working on it my free time. I have a shop to run, you know, but if we need this now, then we could start. Yeah, we could start putting it overdrive. In fact, if all of you help, we could get this done sooner than expected. Hey, if we could teach this thing to actually listen to us, uh, we could get to those hard to reach spots inside of it. <laughs> right on. <laughs> hey, I don't want it me. inside of it. 
<laughs> we can do the thing to get this thing going and we get out of here. Is that what you're telling me? Theoretically, presumably. Yes. Oh, that's so much better than my idea. And she goes and starts to refill her hole. <laughs> looks, looks at, <laughs> looks at the two foot deep hole. <laughs> oh, it's buried. like six feet deep now. <laughs> Uh, I'm the DM, and I will say it okay, is. Okay, sure, fair enough. Four, four feet. I will say it's I four feet. I just like the visual. That's fine. It's, it's all good. Yeah. So you just go back to the the hole you've been digging for literally the past half hour. And you go. Oh, uh -huh. all right. And you start patching it up. Start pushing all that dirt in. Oh. I just shrug. Yeah, I don't know why. Mm. <clears throat> Anyways, but yes, I, I mean, if I give you all some things to do, there's a lot to be done. I think we could be done sooner than expected. I don't know how long, but yeah. And then we could, you know, it would only be fair if I took you guys out of town. Out of town? I'm not sure why I'm trying to leave town. Hey, who cares, buddy? Come with us. It'll be kind of cool. Well, because you'll probably die. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Theatrics, theatrics. I'm trying Funky. to simplify things. I, uh, Slime Man, here's the problem. We pissed off the Prots. This wasn't like the rival Junkers or uh, some city man who came down to look and buy some expensive parts, but then said your parts are garbage. This is the Prots we're talking about. And, right. Well, well, you don't want to mess with the Prots. <laughs> So we just gonna go into space because we're doomed here. Is that what you're saying? Um, yes. Nice. All right. My man more, Toots. More or less. What are you thinking? What, what, you want to come with us? Sure. All right. Got it in the bag. He is not clocking the urgency for him personally to leave. He didn't watch a fight happen. He like scampered away. He has zero context to what <laughs> factions are. <laughs> you four are just like wild, like just things to watch and observe as he figures out what's going on for the next couple of days. Like that is it. Right. I don't now. even think he knows what mortality is. Why would he? He doesn't know what death is, dude. He missed Why the guy getting his head blown off. Oh, yeah. Bummer. Okay. Well? Well, we are getting ahead of ourselves. Like I said, we have some rooms. You can all stay, I guess. Okay. Oh, yeah, dude. Kinda. I'm hitting it. I'm hitting sleep. it. We can figure this shit out tomorrow, okay? I'm, I'm bunking with Squid Man. Ah, nice. Uh, Fly Man walks up to the first box he can see with a crack in it and just goes inside. <laughs> All right. So you guys are sleeping for the night? Uh, yeah. All right. I reckon so. I reckon so as well. Okay. We're all pretty fucked up from earlier. So. Yeah, yeah, you are. Dude, I'm, I'm untouched. I'm golden. Uh, all right. You all will complete a long rest, which means all of your abilities that you have spent, spent, you are now back to full health. Is there a way in this to do that quickly, or do we just have to put I just said, back I, to how it was before? I said there's, there's an points. L rest button oh. under your hit dice. Oh, there it is. L rest. Thank you. I was, I was like, I know there is, but I can't think about. I can't find uh. it. Yeah, so when you open for your token, there's an L rest, cool, press cool, the cool, L cool. rest, and it just, yeah, it'll uncheck all your stuff. It'll let you know how much you heal, et cetera, et cetera. All right, uh, let us, as the daylight peers in, oh, 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 oh. as the daylight peers into the factory windows above. We're gonna go ahead and take a small, uh, small break. So why don't you guys take uh, take a couple minutes, stretch your legs, get some water. Woo! Awesome. Oh, hell yeah! As you'll be, I'm out of here. I'll be back be, in like two minutes. As you'll be awakened 
um, <laughs> by a shard cast. I don't know what that right, is. Be right back. A what? What is? What? What? Uh, I guess you'll, we'll find out. You'll find I guess out. We'll in find a couple out. Of minutes. All right. Okay, I'll be back. <sighs> All right, guys. I'll be right back. I've returned. Greetings. I emailed hello, their hello, tech everyone. support. Oh, hello. hi. <laughs> hi, hi, hi. Hello. We were not talking about taxes. Um, oh my god. Vomit. Am I right? <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> um, I'm checking really quick. Alright, we're good. You guys ready to begin? Or return, rather? Oh yeah. All right. Hell yeah. Good so, morning. So as you awaken, descend down to the bottom. Unfortunately, all the booze has been consumed by the slime man. Um... A shard cast, which essentially is like a small TV screen, uh, turns uh, auto turns on oh. as sort of like an alarm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, interrupts with a important news bulletin. So you begin to you begin to kind of hear as like uh, this this uh, this Kathosian Cuban. It begins the cast simply by stating breaking news. Breaking news. Last night, Clayberry was under attack as the old kobold had been uh, destroyed by unknown ruffians believed to be enemies of the state. With more is the CEO of Zeon Corp, Cray Voldman. And that is where you see this rather like large portly individual currently wearing uh, the typical Zeon Corp suit. By the way, it is, uh, you see on the on the cast, this man, big man, uh, as uh, was in session zero. As he kind of like looks over at the screen and says, we here at Zeon Corporation value our fellow citizens of, of Cryberry 
And when, and when we get attacked like this, we all feel it. We all experience it. And we all weep and suffer for those that have been falling and those that attack in the more uh, undesired areas of Clayberry. That's why Zeon Corp is here to invest in the property as well as the infrastructure of Clayberry because the Kathosian government refuses to. Once again, Kathos refuses to step up and it's up to Zeon Corporation to make do. In fact, we were in dealings with the old Cobalt to purchase the area and turn it into a more into a more desired section of real estate, allowing individuals, specifically that of, of Zeon Corp, uh, to expand upon their warehouses, adding jobs to Crayberry's infrastructure, only to have someone in a brutal attempt of violence do it. Fortunately, Zeon Corporation Security has caught those, or rather, has documented those that we believe responsible for the attack. It's very important if you see these individuals hanging out together that you report them to the KDF or to a Xeon Corporation uh, to a Xeon Corporation security officer immediately. And at that point, you'll see silhouettes uh, specifically of four individuals. Two of them, Orc, one of them, Rackling, and another one appears to be of Alaba uh, appears to be a uh, human, appears to be humanoid. It's at this point, the silhouettes that you figure may have, may resemble you. Dang, that's you guys. anybody. <laughs> <laughs> that could be and anybody. Also, like, what? <laughs> she like freezes in the middle of her morning routine of like silently doing one arm push-ups and then goes and grabs a shovel and starts panic digging. I'm confused. You gotta watch out for Are those you guys, guys bad people? <laughs> no. <laughs> We didn't blow up the bar, you idiot! It is our understanding that these individuals, who obviously blew up the bar... <laughs> That's not what he says. <laughs> <laughs> ...are those that have had dealings with Xeon Corporation in the past. Unfortunately, oh. they have stolen a pharmaceutical product of Xeon Corporation as well. We are interested in their arrest and will pay a high amount of credits. Zeon Corporation is currently offering 5,000 credits for anyone that can provide information to us about these criminals. Well, there you have it, folks. Zeon Corporation putting up a big bounty on a group of ruffians that have blown up a staple of Clayberry infrastructure. And then the news article just ends at that point. Sounds like you guys got to skip town. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's bleak. Pharmaceutical. I don't even know what they're talking about. You steal medicine, Zug? No. Check mm. pockets. Very empty. No. No medicine. Mm. I'm just gonna sit in front of like this ashy yep. pile of non-fire and I'm gonna plop down and start getting food out of my bag and eating it. Alright. <laughs> you start eating some of the food that you got, that you stole from the fish factory uh, the night before. Hmm. Okay. Well, it's gonna be harder to travel around town, but um, I think we should still see my contact. See if he knows anything more about this. We could we could wear like a hat when we do it. Hmm. Yeah. I, I look up at my own hat. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> a different hat. Unrecognizable. Oh. Like uh. uh... What about I'm gonna, a big coat? I'm gonna break a barrel in half and wear the top part over my head. <laughs> I just get a big oversized like tarp and just wrap it around my whole body. I'm gonna find like like a bag and then cut it into like a hockey mask. <laughs> and I'll wrap myself in this net like a a holy cloak. Holy is in full of holes though. 
So do all of us need to go to this thing? Like, what, what, what is... Like, so, just to clear my mind here, we're gonna go meet someone that has yeah. something to do with the trade. Is that right? Yeah. Not right? Necess we don't know. We don't know what they know, but I know them that they might know. So we're gonna find out oh. what they know. Okay. Oh. They might be <laughs> it. Oh. involved yeah. in knowing. You know how... So... It's our lead. It's our only lead. Yeah, it's, it's, our, it's yeah. our only lead, but... Uh... <laughs> The first, you know, Talon before he exploded was a contact that was trying to sell me a part. Mm -hmm. You get the impression okay. that this w is another type of person like that. Got it. Yes, I'm here. Okay. All right. Perfect. So you're okay. going to go ahead and meet with the contacts in the void yards? Yeah, yeah let's roll. All let's, right. Let us go see you Grave. Get the ass. Okay, give me one moment. We are no lights, no light, because now it is currently daytime over in uh, in Clayberry. There we go, and then I'm gonna go ahead and activate this as this clears up. All right. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Uh, right. Oh yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, All right, okay. so some <laughs> some above board information of what has happened. Uh, so from what you saw, you saw silhouettes specifically of individuals. Uh, you'll, the, the only thing that's been advertised is that a group that hangs together is a rackling two orcs and a human. Now, obviously, that can be any anything and anyone. And easy to persuade if anyone's like, hey, or were you the guys that blew up the bar or whatever? Uh, but needless to say, traveling around town, uh, could provide danger uh, if you do anything extraordinarily suspicious. But for right now, your, your uh, let's just say overall threat level currently is low. Um, you are uh, you are more of a curiosity than an immediate surefire thing. By the way, five thousand credits, uh, just so Chad understands, and I think I, I think I told the other group this, and I didn't tell you guys this. What in, in D and D, uh, you got gold, and in this game you have credits. One credit equals one gold. Uh, so five thousand credits is a lot of credits. It is a significant chunk. I gave you all your wealth values uh, before today's session. Uh, no one of you have anywhere near 5,000 God, I'd love to tell you guys my wealth value. Because <laughs> it made me actually laugh like, when Brett sent it to me. I gave, yeah, I gave all of you uh, your wealth value, why your wealth value is, and what essentially is your reason. Yeah, mine was pretty damning. He, he, and I quote, says to me in a message, within your coat is 10 credits. Your wealth value is one. Within your code is 10 credits and an assortment of random materials that can get you another 10 credits if pawned slash traded for. Current wealth connections are unknown because you were born 10 minutes ago and he follows all that up with a good luck. Yep. <laughs> oh boy. Tomato specifically told me he wanted to be on hard mode. So I was like, <laughs> so if, if, everything I say to him now is just good luck. Good luck. <laughs> Godspeed. Cause yeah, he let be a moocher. You guys are free to share your wealth values with each other in character if you want to or out of character. It's not a secret. It's it's as much as you guys want to share depending on how much that you guys know and what you'd like to, what knowledge and information you guys have. Um, I will let you know that the small market is currently open. The small market, uh, if you do just ever decide to go there, um, <clears throat> is where you can buy sundries and common weapons and armor if you're interested in, in if you ever need something there. There's also a small stand of uh, shard stones uh, that rotate daily um, that sells uh, exactly that, shard stones. The shard stones that you currently have. Um... <clears throat> Excuse me, my God. I hiccuped and I nearly choked. Um, <laughs> the shard stones that you have are plus one to stat uh, stats. Um, but these shard stones may give something different that you can replace with. Um, there are also shard stone recipes that, when that if learned, you can combine certain shard stones to make a collective, like a, a shard stone cluster, uh, that will take up your one and only shard stone slot. Uh, but yeah, the small market has—it's where you buy. Uh, you can buy potions. It's, it's small markets where you buy all your things. So if you're ever interested and want to go there, it takes up time of your day, um, but you are free to do that. Uh, your contact is a security guard over at the Void Yards. 
So where would you like to go? Uh, I guess I'll, I'll let the, the crew know about the smalls. Yeah, we call it the smalls here in town because it's, you know. <laughs> the uh -huh. smalls. It, it's a local thing. Yeah, we do. Yeah. I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, what? It's true. Scribbles in <laughs> notes. The smalls. So if you guys need anything, we can hit the smalls or, um, yes, we could go to my contact Graven in Void Town. Dude, All I'm right. way too nervous to go shopping right now. Okay. Void also got that bear. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, they got the bear, and I do want to punch the bear. Don't punch the bear. Don't none of us I know that I have the to bear, prove myself to it. Oh, yeah, but yeah, the only <laughs> yeah. one that knows the bear currently is Zug and Drask, unless you two share it with the rest of the party. Yeah, so fair once enough. Drask says the void has the bear, which he is yeah, now. Yeah, I would say that out loud without realizing I didn't tell anyone yeah, it was a side to Everyone, you have all just learned bear? This is the first time hearing of bear. No, it's okay. That's my knee-jerk reaction is still wanting to punch a bear. Yeah, so you, yeah, you're, you're, you're like, well, I want to punch a bear. Yeah. My... There's no bear in Voidium Town. <laughs> what are you talking about? It was in a cage, okay? Oh, sure. Why didn't we see it then? Oh, well, I'll show you. We're going right now. Uh, Drask yeah, my... immediately charges ahead to the Void Yards. I follow. <laughs> Bo, what were you, you going to say, slash two? Uh, when Drask says the word bear, all of my fur just poofs and stands up. And I just say, bear? <laughs> my eyes are just like glossed over. And I slowly Fuck. follow the party. Uh oh. <laughs> oh man, the raccoon is bear trauma shit. <laughs> bear. Bear. <laughs> There's a bee. There's a bear in apartment there. Um, all right, so as you arrive over. Is there places that are like off limits here that we should? Oh yeah, the void vaults, uh, the void yards itself. Uh, yeah, th those are the, those places are absolutely and off limits. And in the void yards is where I heard it? In the direction of the void yards is where okay. you heard it, yes. Uh, but you know, walking across this area is there. Um, as you go over to the oh, over to the area uh, where your contact is, Zug, you arrive over at the security station. There. Do, 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 do. Rainbow's four notes. Uh, there, you see uh, Graven, who is currently on duty. Hey. hey. Uh, you'll actually see him over in, in, in the stand as one of the security officers. Uh, he looks over to you and he kind of has for a brief moment an exhausted face before he looks over to you, snapping his finger and goes, oh, wait, you. Hello. Uh, Zug, right? Yeah. <laughs> you remembered. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on over. Come in here. He'll open up the stand, allowing you all in. It's a very cramped and small room that he's working at. It kind of is essentially like a security booth of like either like a gatehouse, like a modern day gatehouse or, or anything like that. You do see a variety of cameras over around the void yards, outside the void vaults, all over on the shard screens themselves. He uh, points over at you, offering a hand and said, I was actually hoping to reach out to you. Really? Well, do you have a part? Um, kind of. Oh, you brought your brother. Good. And then he just kind of looks over at Drask with this, um, mm, oh, what's the word? A needy eyes. It's not like uh, uh it's not. I want to say like eyes of desire, but that makes it sound like he's got the hot <laughs> oh. Drask. But yeah, exactly. He, but he looks at Drask like Drask's got something he needs, essentially. And he's like, you know, it's actually, oh yeah, I wanted to, to speak with you, you, you and your brother. Uh-huh. Yeah. 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 Uh, and then he kind of pulls out a chair and sits down and says, look, I understand you've been looking for some parts, right? Yeah. Well, it just so happens I got myself a hit. I got my hands on an old power supply as well as an old FTL drive. And I was wondering if, well, 
we could go ahead and make a trade. Yeah, yeah. What, what, what do you need? I could, I could find you something over in the waste yard. No, no, you know, no, no, no. I heard the scrap. Huh? Nothing like that. And he looks over at your brother. He's a, he's a capable fighter, right? Oh, absolutely. He's the best there is. Gotcha. Then uh, he looks around a little bit. Oh, uh, uh, Greg, nice to meet you. Looking over at everyone. Uh, question for the slime man. How exactly have you disguised <laughs> him? <laughs> you know? Did anyone try to disguise him? I would say I tried putting question. pants on him, but how did that play out? You did, how would you pants work on this pants thing? Pants on him? Yeah, like sort of let him goop <laughs> down into it, sort of drip. Unless we had an uninterrupted five minutes of you teaching <laughs> him how to wear pants, so those things morning. are at the hideout. <laughs> <laughs> like they slid, they slid off like instantly. <laughs> okay, so you've done nothing uh, to disguise oh, yeah, at this point. <laughs> Okay. I was staying real quiet because I was wondering if someone would get so, him like So clothes. as as he looks around to greet everyone, he takes a look at the slime man. And he just stares at him. Uh he's just one of Zug's experiments. What's going on? <laughs> he looks over at, <laughs> looks over to Zug. Zug what? shrug. <laughs> Zug shrug. <laughs> what <laughs> he doesn't believe that. He's just like, what? <laughs> I was born 17 hours and 49 minutes ago. <laughs> what did you do? I didn't do anything. Listen, we'll get out of your hair. Just tell us what you need us to do. Uh, what? And he just, he won't let it go. What is that? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> and Hell yeah. <laughs> and you brought it? <laughs> and you brought it into my office? It's friendly enough. Where yeah, he's, you... he's still, he's cool. He's cool. Don't worry what? about it. Well, no, but your brother just said you, you made this. All he does is eat. Well, he didn't make me. He did make, he did participate, I believe, in the explosion that made me. <gasps> he looks over at the slime man. Oh God. I'm just gonna go ahead and do a little inside <laughs> check of my own. <laughs> 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 I will end Sorry, you. gang. I, I, I will really have to laugh. True. I will push you down into the fucking sewers. He looks over at the slide fan, saying "explosion," and then no, looks over no. at you. He means like, like you know, birth is an explosion. Yeah, you know, uh, I'm the bomb of life. <laughs> yeah, he's the bomb, man. He's the I'm bomb. The bomb. Word. <clears throat> I need you to make a a persuasion check. You want me to? Uh, no, Sug specifically. Red. <laughs> He's the bomb. Come on. <laughs> uh, uh, whatever. I don't have time for this. Look. Who do you need me to fight? Yeah. Oh, so you managed to distract him long enough. Because he was about to piece together that you're the one in people that they were like. So, so you're like, so immediately as you step in, like, who do you want to fight? He shakes his head and goes, uh, if, right. Uh, anyways. Yeah. So it looks like you've gotten into some little bit of, of rough mess and I have as well. So we don't need to talk more on the subject. There's some sort of creature wandering around the void yards. The bear! Yo, oh, shit! Like, Bo mumbling. <laughs> I told you, Zug! Well, hold on there. Where bear? I have never seen a hair. He, he, is it over there? <laughs> he, uh, <laughs> why is he talking like that? He does this. <laughs> you'll, uh, you'll see Gravin go, but he, it's her sign in nature. Specific. Yeah, I, yeah. Wait. How do you know about that? I mean, I heard it last night. You heard it's it? It's very loud. Yes, it's in a cage or something. Oh. Oh no, it's it's not it's not in any cage. Um <gasps> and he scratches his head a little bit. <sighs> well, if I could make a guess, you guys might be in a bit of uh Maybe in a bit of trouble with the Zeon Corporation. When aren't we? 
well, I might be in a little bit of trouble as well. I think they have <sighs> improperly disposed a bio sample. This bio sample. Oh shit, you guys too? A bear. <laughs> he chokes a little bit. I think you'd be better for all of our health at this point. <laughs> if we don't discuss further about this topic, but <laughs> if I were to theorize, yes. Uh, yeah, it's always been rumored that Xeon's been doing some pretty, well, some pretty fucked up shit with bio experimentation, and I think. Uh, yeah. Some intern. Yeah, some interns probably disposed of this thing. Uh, that's not a bear in a cage. This is some sort of ursine creature that has, uh, like, almost like magnesis powers. It has chunks of metal constantly floating around it. And anytime any of us have tried to get near it, it quite possibly, it quite literally decapitated, and he does like a chopping motion with his neck, one of the security officials with a Ooh. chunk of metal that he's thrust uh. in. Well, that's terrifying. Yeah. I don't want to fight the bear. Yeah, you, I don't. I better, I better get both parts for this. And he uh, leans back a little bit and goes, well, I think one or the other could suffice. No, no, no. Mm. You're talking about something that's killing people out here. Well, from my understanding, you've got something that's potentially killing people out here. Leans forward. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I also lean forward. <laughs> he also leans forward. <laughs> Kiss. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> How about, hmm, I'll give You're you an free. extra hundred credits. You're free to roll a persuasion if you'd like. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, go, so you're offering credits uh, with along with your persuasion. Is that correct? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Persuade. Oh, is your roll, oh. Mm. Hmm. He sits back. This is a dangerous job. You know, if you don't take care of this bear, you might be the next one to go have to deal with it. <laughs> he thinks to himself, you take care of the creature and a hundred credits. I'll give you the FTL drive and the power supply. Yes. Uh, um, yeah. All right. It seems to wander around during the evening we're not certain where it goes during the daytime. And I can't, I can't let you in the void yards during the day as well. I could probably sneak you in at night. So come back during the evening. And okay. we'll see if we can scout out this creature. Deal. Wait, hang on. No deal. Hold. It deal. <laughs> <laughs> Drask. <clears throat> hey, no hey, deal. Drask. Sidebar. Yeah. Sidebar. Okay. Sidebar. <laughs> Sidebar. <laughs> you think you could take this thing? I mean, why can't I take? I'm still here. I've won every fight I've been in. Yeah. And ooh, we got friends. Yeah. Okay. Deal. No deal. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> deal. <laughs> why no deal? Deal. 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 Yep. Where? Deal? <laughs> now looking at Bo. Deal. <laughs> Deal? No. Be bear. Yes. Bear. It is, it is a bear. Meal. I am hungry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We're going to go get a meal. We'll come back tonight. All right. Deal. Then. Okay. Deal. All right. Deal. You, you at that point, you guys leave. I uh, lean forward again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He leans back. <laughs> All right. Okay, bye. <laughs> so you guys leave and you're going to go and get some food next? Yeah. 
Yeah. All right. Get our you're breakfast. Gonna, you're going to head on over to this breakfast bar over here by the shard spire. The light of the shard spire that powers this section of the city just is illuminating, just, just beaming into the windows over there. But you're able to get some nice eggs, and uh, you sit down and get, and get yourself a rest. Now, is there anything you guys would like to do during this day before the evening hours? Before you've got to hunt a bear down. Is my shop in this section? Where, where's like my my prop Your stand? work area? It'd probably in the smalls. Okay, okay. Wicked. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wicked. Um, so once again, <clears throat> as you enter the bar, how are you hiding the slime man? <laughs> oh God. Oh yeah. You I'm know, glad actually, you get to ask them that because I'm not doing <laughs> God damn it. I know for a fact after you're just wandering him, around, yeah. After the encounter with the with Graven, Graven, um I will give him my my big tarp that I put on and I'll wrap nice. him in that and I'll say, You have to wear this, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna. Uh, can I? Can I roll a D twenty like just luck check to see how well my yeah. character like un, like even is able to handle this tarp on him? I'd love that. Excellent. I'm just gonna do flat D twenty. Good. Hey. Okay, okay. Okay. All right. Nice. He's able. He's still... able to hold his form with this on it. His spooky eyes poking out of the it's tarp. It's still not that convincing. Yeah, it just looks yeah. like a big like, tarp moving off the ground. He, he, <laughs> generally, he, big tarp. he just looks like, like an oil worker almost, just covered in in weird oil. He actually Ugh. looks like someone that's been probably working the depths of the of the void yards. And because he has that like that super grimy look with the tarp, uh people don't make eye contact with the slime man. As to not be rude. And if they did, they would see he has vertical eyes instead of left and yeah. right. They don't look. They just go, oh, God. And it, it, it literally is that, like, that knee-jerk reaction of, like, of, like, seeing, seeing, like, something wrong and then being like, I can't, I don't want to stare. I can't stare. I shouldn't stare. You know, like, like <laughs> that. Yeah. The, so that's, if anyone does look towards them, they immediately look away. What so is wrong to, with these people? So as to not be rude. They're just people. Um, Probably let's see. in the mines. Something horrible happened to him. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, do we do anything else before nightfall? I guess we could go back and, like, work on the ship. I bring up to party, which is now in character. We could go back to the ship and, and start working. Maybe we could attach some paneling or, or do some more designing. <laughs> Always good to work on, yes. Oh, uh, you could see if there's any parts in this leg I got. Did someone pay for my food? <laughs> <laughs> because otherwise we gotta go back, man. Because I'm not done over if, there. If it was cheap, yeah, I would have. <laughs> uh, I think you two credits is easily enough for everyone for their meal. Yeah. All right. Subtract two credits from your amount. Return back. Uh, would you all work on the ship along with? I mean, you're you, you need daily work to make this thing actually assemble into yeah. a ship. So yeah. Okay. Yeah. Maybe we maybe we should do that to. I would get try to taskmaster a bit and like. Okay. Uh, you know. So. Well, just bring me that piece over there. Felsic. <laughs> Attach that to the top. Yeah. Yeah, I got you, homie. So are we are we in there? Yes. Yeah, so, yeah, so you guys you guys will be in there. Um and it's just you you guys are just going to be basically be doing like like medial task work. You guys aren't necessarily yeah. assembling any of the key components yet. So all it is is just literally getting everything together to to just just get a general layout going. So no checks are going to be required for this as all that is needed is time. So yeah, you're just assembling pieces just Sm not smelting, but just like assembling chunks of metal together to actually get everything there. Um, so progress has been done with the ship. Yippee! Nothing to nice. Nothing to announce as of yet because there is a lot of key components that you need to do, and we will talk more at the end of the session um, of what you can be doing around town to gather the stuff that is necessary to build the ship. But for now. 
you have a you have a job, correct? B- b- bear. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, yeah, bear. Well, uh, let's see. Oh, after this is this will be during our break. We took a break between the hard labor <laughs> and yeah. uh, going out, so. So we'll stand up, stretch out a bit, crack his neck. Okay. No more messing around. You got a pretty scary job to take on, but don't worry. Drask will handle it. We just gotta go stab it. Back him up. If I could stab it, it'll die. Let's just hope All it's right. not made of metal, I guess. So. Everyone ready? Mm-hmm. Everyone ready? I Hell do yeah, not know how to fight. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh shit! No, maybe maybe a little like dress. awaken something in you. You can learn from dress. <laughs> I can teach you some things, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, I don't you think can you like can just throw rocks though. at it. If you throw things, can you like grab it with your hand? Hand. And you're appendage, just gonna see like a, a appendage just start coming out of his face. Okay, I guess. Yeah, that's perfect, buddy. Looks really good. Just hit it with that. How about you just hold this, and I'll I'll hand him this little like section of uh, PVC pipe that has <laughs> just like a little lens that's just clearly cracked and broken. And then I shake it a bit, and I slap it against, and I bang it on it with a hammer, and then it starts to. Ding, and starts emitting this little 10 foot light. Five feet of bright light, five feet of dim light. And I'm like, just hold this, be our flashlight. <laughs> right on. All right, I hand him that and then we'll, we'll make our way. Sounds good to me. All right. So perhaps an above board warning for all of you guys. If this thing is actually a bear, it, it's going to be a challenging encounter. It would literally be like if I told the five of you to fight a bear that was in my backyard. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's do it. <laughs> so. I mean, one of us has a gun, yeah? It's I just. Gun. No, imagine Here's, telling four people and like a baby. Yeah. That's yeah. Really <laughs> more of a baby. As a. Uh, baby so with a I, I wanted to make sure that you guys are in the heads up that we aren't doing the oh, it's a tutorial enemy it's fine and then like you level up and it gets harder you no guys well, are dude. you guys are diving <laughs> into the deep end like you are if you are diving into the deep end so please be cautious please be careful and i have no problem killing off each and every one of you <laughs> if necessary heck yeah Hell right. yeah. yeah. Hell uh, yeah. All right. Let's go. So <laughs> Let's you get ca- the ass. So as you arrive in the void yard, you meet up with your contact, uh, Gravin, who seems to be especially uncomfortable. He looks over at you. Zug. Where have you been? What? What? Oh, I, thought you, I thought you were going to be here like an hour ago. Oh, I'm seems sorry. Unsettled. I didn't know you... We're specific. We're here now. What, what's going on? It, it's here. Oh, shit. I got a text. Hang on. Let me check my phone. <laughs> I got a text. Look. Everyone checks their phone. His shard device. <laughs> my shard phone. That was me. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah? Please, follow me. I'll, I'll take you over to where he is. Wait. Wait, wait. Has anyone seen it? He points to himself. You, son? Yeah. How big is this thing? He holds out his arms. Is it like really ripped? Is it like a really shredded bear? Is it like a tough boy? I've never seen a bear before, but... Yo, that boy's thick. God, <laughs> but, yeah. Both God ears, damn it. like... That boy, thick. <laughs> no, no, don't teach him that line. <laughs> he nods over at the slime man. The, the, that boy thick. That boy thick. Bo's okay. ears are like flattening, and then he's like slowly hiding behind that tarp that Squid Boy's wearing. Just mumbling to himself under the tarp. 
You, you good, Bo? Are you ready for this? It's okay, little buddy. Maybe it's not okay. No, you we're gonna beat his ass. <laughs> okay, yeah, 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 yeah. We got. Why are we all concerned? Only I'm not. Ask has to fight. <laughs> uh, yeah. I'll be yeah. backing him up. It's, uh, it's, listen, you two, you three, two, you, you just jump in if you see an opportunity. Okay. Sure thing. Wait, wait, so like an ambush? I can do an ambush. Yeah. Yeah, maybe like an ambush. You guys are currently <laughs> walking down the void yards while you're explaining this. As you then hear the rustling of something scr- digging and scraping metal. Okay. Yeah, go, go, go hide over there. Oh, that was sick. <laughs> As you then see it. Holy shit! Oh, oh shit! He's blue! This large creature with jagged, what appears to be metal shutting out of its face is eating the metal, is eating the trash out there. It doesn't seem to be aware of your presence. I would also like to let you know that if you do start moving around, points at, points at Poe, um, <laughs> this is where uh, you will, okay, so everyone, this is the position that you guys are, are walking in, is that correct? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Any, fur- yes. any further movement at this point will risk getting the attention of the of the of the bear. Rask, <laughs> it's time. <gasps> I know, says, I know, I got at, this. At loud. How, you, I'm assuming you say that loud. loud he doesn't as you're know what a whisper in. is. I say it normal. <laughs> yeah, it's time. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Gonna go ahead and do a skill. Gonna, gonna go ahead and do a, a, a secret a, skill. A, a, maybe a little muffled underneath a tarp, but that is it. <laughs> the chewing of the metal stops as you see <gasps> the creature's ears perk up. Who who just above board? Who had the gun again? Was it Bo or Bo. was it me? Okay, okay. For remembering, that's it. Continue. Is the bear doing anything else? Its head continues to dig into the trash. Okay. I'm gonna look towards slime and go. Lower your voice. You quiet. Huh. <laughs> Thumbs up comes out of a uh, out of his face. <laughs> Zug's gonna start looking at the group and just doing absolute nonsense hand signs. He throws up a two, a five, points forward, points back, <laughs> left and right, up, right. down, no. and then a fist pump. He, there aren't oh, any good places idea. Slime Boy starts trying to fiddle here. with and turn on the flashlight. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hi, everybody. Uh, the roll initiative sign has just turned on. I need everyone to select their token and roll initiative. <laughs> I didn't say he turns it on. I said he's trying to. Oh, I mean, I, that, I'm just letting just, you know. Just, just if, in case you would oh, roll no, it because I'm, of that. I, okay. uh, I, I'm aware. We are in high stress, so flashlight on or off. I need everyone to Okay, I, I, just, I just want to make sure. <laughs> I just want to see you guys sweat a little bit. <laughs> Is it under check damn commoner too <laughs> yeah dude <laughs> no. yeah he was fucking ready get him man uh, I, uh who was asking uh oh yeah select your token and then mouse over utility and you'll see roll initiative oh okay got it perfect nice all right <laughs> okay uh Gravin whispers under his breath all right. Let me know when you're done. Good luck. Why are you leaving? <laughs> Where is he going? Wait, you're not going to help? Well, if he no. helps, he can lower the reward. <laughs> <laughs> and okay. now he quietly dashes away. 
Okay, we're, we got this. We got this. <laughs> Fuck no. <laughs> no, no, no. That's more XP for us. Let him go. Zug. Let me do some calculation. Mm-hmm. 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 Hey, Brett, how do I open the initiative page? Because I can't see it on my screen. Uh, It's the fist. Ah, thanks. If you right click it, it pops out. Thank you. Okay. Zug will start to go for flank angle. Let me see. Song gives you a thumbs up. You are still far enough where a stealth check is not required to move. But as you get closer to the bear, I may request you make a stealth check to make sure that it does not hear you. Um, okay, okay. Uh, so that was my movement for my action. I'd like to ready an action to, if this thing gets within 60 feet of me, I'm going to fling a catapult at it. Otters. Otters clap. Otters. All right. Does that enter room? Yeah. Bo, in a moment of fear, <laughs> you see the creature. And then you realize you've never actually seen a bear before. Because when would a bear fucking be wandering around the city? <laughs> As fear creeps into your heart. Make a mental note. Maybe you can one day become a bear. Whoa. Huh? I mean, you have... <clears throat> hey. <laughs> you hey. Have, you have learned the ability to transform into a bear once you gain the wild shape ability. Whoa. Hey, how do I, how do, I do that? <laughs> I don't know what you're doing right now. Well, you don't know you don't know how to do it yet. But next level, uh, when you learn how to wild shape, bear will be one of your options. <gasps> nice. What? Yo! That's fucking wicked. Oh, uh, hell yeah. God, yeah. I always forget like none of you have subclasses but me right now, and I don't know how to fight. That's a bummer. Um, <laughs> also, puts, puts on glasses, adjusts wizard's hat. I have added custom druid mechanics gasp so typically in D&D fashion as long as you've seen a beast or a creature you would be able to transform into it but as you can tell from name and appearance this is no ordinary bear if you spend your time studying this creature in combat with nature checks and succeed you can acquire traits of this creature that you can append onto the transformation of the bear. Whoa. So right now oh my you can God. only transform into the bear, but as you learn stuff about special bears like this, you can take some of those traits and apply it to your bear transformation. Okay. And that's through nature checks, you said? Correct. You may spend a bonus a action. Yeah, so you may spend a bonus action or an action to take a nature check. Okay. Success or failure, you spend that action. Okay. And do I have to be a certain distance away to study it, or can I do it from far away? 60 feet. 60 feet. Okay. And yes. right now that it, we, I'm going to do the ruler thing. Yeah, you are. Or very far. You're going to have to get a little bit closer. It's all good. Only 60 feet from the bear. So, like, here. That's so make fun. sure when you're drawing the ruler, draw it from the bear, not the not the not the uh, spot below it. Yeah, like that. Okay. Yep, right there would be a perfect spot. Okay, and I can move thirty feet. You said. Yes, you can. Okay. I want Bo to hesitantly. I mean, if I move, can I move Bo thirty feet hesitantly behind? Zug? Yes, you can You can move wherever you'd like. Okay, then I'm going to drag, and then... Wasn't it... Someone said it was, like, shift, and I can, like, 
do it automatically. That, yeah, there we go. Hey, you did it. Nice. Hey. Okay, and then I have a bonus action. Is that right? Uh, you have a bonus or action it... and an action. So during a turn, you can take an action, a bonus action, mm -hmm. and move. But you can replace so if your I... action with a dash, which allows you to move again. Okay. And dash is 30 feet or, or half or? It's your movement speed again. Up to your movement speed again. Okay. Oh, but if... if uh, oh, no, this is really scary. Um, so he smiles scary. and nods. No, you can't. <laughs> because you're following the plan he made up in his head that didn't he didn't explain with the, the hand signals. Somehow you're following that still, so... Uh, <laughs> I'm going to... I'm going to very hesitantly... Very. Gooch. So, sorry. <gasps> you are within <laughs> 60 feet of the bear. You have a bonus oh my action remaining. I'm like shaking and, and I'm like, maybe there's like a little bit of tears in my eyes. I'm barely holding it together. Barely. Oh. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Okay. Sorry. Okay. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> Uh, so from this point, <laughs> I can do a nature check. Is that right? Yes, that's correct. Oh my! Oh my gosh! I'm so Why does... sorry. Barely. Barely. <laughs> All right, oh you've rolled God. an eleven. Lena. Yes. You have succeeded the nature check. What? Magnes I'm shaking. Magnesis Bear knows three traits, and you can learn one of them. Oh. I, I will not tell you what the traits do. You must select one that sounds appealing to you, and you will acquire that trait. Only then will I tell you what the trait is. The three traits are Magnet Aura, Metal Impact, Metallic Hide. What would you like to learn? It feels like a game show. <laughs> the music. <laughs> it Metallic does. Hide. <clears throat> okay, I need to write this down and see it visually. Metallic hide. Yep. What were the other two? I can, uh, I'll type it out. Magnet aura. Metal impact. Boom. Metallic hide. Okay, Bo starts like kind of very, very, very slowly, like turning around, uh, turn over his shoulder and looks at Zug. <laughs> you start saying these traits, Zug smiles and shrugs, not knowing what you're saying. You're like talking <laughs> druidic to him. <laughs> I'm like looking at my little tiny paws and my tiny paws are shaking and I'm just repeating metallic hide, magnet aura, metal impact. Uh, Why does the small hairy child keep trying to feed itself to large animals and things that can eat it? <laughs> Zug I, gives a fat thumbs up. We got uh, this. I feel like metallic hide makes the most sense for a tank. So, as I'm not really a huge damage dealer, I will go with metallic hide in hopes that it sounds like it can protect those around me. Right. Show me Metallic Hide! Metallic Hide <laughs> is as follows. When you transform into a bear, the bear's AC is increased by two. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, can someone yeah, uh, it, translate that? Can someone translate that? It, AC means, harder to hit, it means it's harder to hit. Which is funny because like, you think with is... it being metallic, it would be easier to hit. It's tankier. <laughs> it's exactly <laughs> what you wanted. Yeah. Yes. You All think right. that like if someone shoots arrows at you, you'd be unable to dodge them on account of the fact that your hide is metallic. Well, AC has more. Yeah, AC has more to do than just dodging. If you yeah. got that oh, thick hide, cool. the arrow will bounce, hit, may bounce off. Chance to hit with AC is not expressly your dodgy skills. It's. Well, your... yeah, I, I was I, sorry. I was explaining this like to someone who has never oh, played no, D&D before. You're good. <laughs> I'm, this, I'm saying this to Tomato. Yeah, you're good. <laughs> Tomato out here trying to me, 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 me. He was born last night. He was born yesterday. He dude. was born last night, yeah. 
give, give him okay. a Okay. So yes, uh, when, it, when you wild shape into a bear, you can wild shape into a bear with the trait Metallic Hide, which will increase the armor class of the bear by two. Okay. I like slowly put my paws down. My fur starts being puff, start stops being puffy. I stand up straight. And my eyes narrow. That's it. It's gonna be a real bummer if Bo gets one shot in the turn. <laughs> <laughs> Just eaten entirely. <laughs> Tomato says with the biggest smile. <laughs> it's gonna be a real bummer. <laughs> All right. Uh, Magnesis Bear continues to eat the garbage. And that's what it does on its turn. Felsic, it's your turn. Yeah, she's gonna like punch Drask on the shoulder and be like, hey, Drask, uh, we're the tough ones, so we should probably pull the bear to us, yeah? Yeah, that's what I was gonna do. Yeah. Uh, I I would really, really like to sprint to get into range, but I'm not gonna be able to take any actions if I do that. So instead, I'm just going to approach. Wait, how do I do this? Shift? Shift. Make sure that you're dragging from your token as well. Yep. I. Uh oh. What? Okay, I don't know how to do this. Anyways, I'll just move 25 feet up. Lena, uh, how, how did you do it? Uh, I right clicked. Oh, oops, no, I didn't. I um had the ruler on, I think it was, and then I dragged it on like right on top of my picture, and then I pressed space. Ah, space. What? Hmm. Wait, so, space, not shift. Correct. Uh. Uh-uh. Okay, uh, and just to be super, super sure, I'm going to take a dodge action, uh, and that's going to be my turn. Okay. Uh, next up, the slime man. How do I turn this thing on? <laughs> How do I turn that? What? Hey. What? Hey, it's not the flashlight, I think. What are you saying? How do I make this, How do I make this work? <laughs> <laughs> it tangles the flashlight in front of you. I I point to my ear. I can't hear you. I do not understand. What? You need... He starts, like, he starts mimicking <laughs> what you were doing and making like numbers with his like weird hand. Oh. He's waving at you. <laughs> the, the flashlight, just for no reason, would just turn on again. Nothing you did did anything, but it turns on. <laughs> so oh. I've got a flashlight on right now over here. Yeah. Yeah. But it's five feet bright and uh, five feet dim, so it's literally that far. This is the weakest thing I've ever seen. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> this light is just blaring your eye right now. <laughs> I was trying to tell you that I didn't know how to turn it on. Oh, oh my God. But I figured God. it out, I think. You don't need to have it on right now. <laughs> what was that? He said, you don't have to deep it. You can turn it off and get away from me. <laughs> All right. Uh, he's just going to say here. <laughs> All right. Hold on. I'm trying to find the, uh, where do I want? What, what, uh, okay. Just get a doot. Oh yeah, this one. I want this one to be all the way up there. Actually, uh, Brett. Yes. I am going to, if, if, actually, you know what? No, I'm gonna do nothing. Okay. I do <laughs> want to add a fun fact, gang, that um, going into this fight, I actively chose not to take any armor with this character for now. So oh I am all God. naked. <laughs> yeah, so yeah that's know. fair. Yeah, that's fair. Okay. Why would I, why would I expect more? <laughs> You have a base AC though. Base AC is like ten. Yeah, I've got. I actually think the game may have automatically put my put leather on me, which is the weakest armor I could put on my character. Yeah, uh, but uh, you said you, you you don't have armor. Is that correct? Yeah. All right. Take that is, away. Yeah, it has been taken away. But what I'm wearing is a basic cloth coat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Frowns. Drastic. Until yeah. someone clothes me, I'm not wearing anything but this. <laughs> I walk forward. One, two, three, four. I walk the old fashioned way, thanks. Okay. Uh, I'll take dodge action. And okay. That is it. Top of the round. Coming or two. Uh, gonna give you guys a big old thumbs up. <laughs> and leave the fucking map. <laughs> Bye, man. Love you. Hooray. <laughs> <laughs> mm. All right. Uh, Bo, 
It is your turn. Uh-huh. Hmm. Just kidding. Zug, it is your turn. Uh-huh. Hmm. What are we doing? We're fighting the bear. Just watch my that lead. was Drask's job. <laughs> yeah, but we can, like, help. Watch this. Zug will roll forward. Two, two rolls, <laughs> like, for no reason. Not stealthy at all. Mm, Dark Souls fat rolling. Wow. Nice, eh? That was really cool. And he'll slowly <laughs> reach into his bag of jingly scrap, trying to not make too much noise. And he's going to pull out another pre-made little hand cannon device that just absolutely is not a gun. It shouldn't function. But as he puts his hands to it, you see these, like sparkly zappy magics flow into this device and he takes aim from 60 feet away in a crouch and right before as he's got his good aiming he looks to drask kind of gives him like a you ready oops i'll a thumbs up all right he leans his head into the no scope <laughs> and just a plain barrel trying to get as accurate as possible What's the DC? I wait. I rolled it. It didn't appear. Help. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I I pressed cast on the thing. I could do it. Ooh, I could do it in here though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I use that. Okay. A deck save of 14. Oh no. It hits yeah! the bear in the head for how much damage? Do I click damage here? Yes, you do. Whoa! <laughs> Not bad! Damn, I do! Wow. It's good you were That's able to hit, hit it because he was so thick. <laughs> See, I learned that. <laughs> You're so a thick boy. Boy. Charge! His head turns around, looking over at you. What do you do, Zug? Uh, as this contraption I had pre-made in my hands fucking explodes into like a confetti of trash again, because I can't make anything that lasts, you know, long with this short amount of time, and he throws it to the side because it's it used its purpose. He raises a big green middle finger. Oh, that's my that's my turn. <laughs> Slime man learns this. He <laughs> <laughs> Magnesis bear takes a legendary action what? right after your Ooh. What? As it, I was I thought we had to take turns. Or were we not taking turns? As it looks up into the air with a roar, you will see chunks of metal now begin to like just clank all over him as he forms metallic armor around his thick hide. Is that the is that the is that the metallic hide? Is that what that is? Uh, nope. Okay, just just checking, just checking. It is not. As it will then gain, let me see if I can actually put this up. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm trying to see if I can, I'm trying to get, see if I can give. Anyways, it gains 14 temporary hit points. Ooh. Oh, all right. Okay. That's LOL. what I did to him. Damn, yeah, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and yeah. As it does that, that is where we will end today's session Ooh. with oh. Pipe Dreamers. No! Oh, absolute cliffhanger. I want to oh. punch him. I cannot believe you. Yep. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Booyah, baby. So it gains uh, 14 temporary hit points as a legendary action as it gets ready, clad to fight you all once and for all. I will let you know that if you succeed at this fight, 
you will level up to two. <laughs> so something to look forward to. Look forward okay. to. Look forward to. Look forward to. <laughs> <laughs> and if you fail, <laughs> we're well, that's, that's the end, end of the campaign. Well, you yeah. guys are all dead. I, I slide into a small crack. Yeah, that's the end. That's, okay. the, that's, the, that's the end of the campaign. Yeah, exactly. All right. Uh, that was that was great, guys. You guys have fun today. Extremely. I loved it. That was a ton dude of I, I love being a big anchor for the whole group just holding <laughs> the like, we've been sailing and no one's realized that we're scraping the anchor all along the bottom of the ocean floor <laughs> <laughs> uh, we've destroyed a few coral reefs at this point and we're still dragging that anchor though like um, people keep like going like i can't believe tomato just did that and i'm sitting here like i can't believe no one has told me not to in the group because that's like all it takes to make no i like it <laughs> And meanwhile, as DM, I'm just like, oh, I don't really have to do anything. OK, this is cool. This is all right. <laughs> you fight normal dude. And he's just like, I don't have to do anything. This is pretty sick. This is all right. All right. Let me uh, let me go and get some Zug Yard music in here because I was vibing with that. Hell yeah. I like my pad. I like my pad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I'm glad you liked your pad. I, too, like your I pad. I hope I survive so I can turn into a giant, like, void bear. What yeah. the heck? Once you're level two, you'll be able to turn into a bear with magnesis traits. And that's not all. That is all. so cool. That is not all oh. I have in store for your druid transformation abilities, but that <gasps> we will leave secret for now. Needless to say, yeah, druid, druid wild shape is getting a lot of customization, so. Oh baby! It's gonna be oh yeah! It's gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, all right. Why? Well, uh, it is fan art time because great googly moogly, we got quite a bit of fan art. I had to, I had to, I had to scroll up here for this. So <clears throat> let me go ahead and get this here. We're gonna do screen share, and then chat's gonna go ahead and see the fan art, and it's gonna be <gasps> absolutely awesome. So go in live with that. So you guys don't have to worry about that. Uh, I'm gonna hit the snooze button a couple of times. Yeah, we got time for that. Perfect. It, all right. You guys ready? Here. Yes. We. Yeah. Go? Question mark. This one. That's the one. Boom, baby. Here we go. Bow acquired shield. I I asked Le I asked uh, Lena after the, the 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 stream. I was like, Yo, what if we just make your shield a skateboard? Like actually Hell turn yeah. that into a property. So like every like if you get something something silly like you know if uh, if it, if something doesn't break your armor class, you get plus five movement as you like drop the oh. shield and skate along or something fun like that. Something fun and, and custom like that. That's gonna be really cool. Woo. Hell yeah. Okay, hold on. That's Gosh, rad. Man. That's wicked. <laughs> I'm not used to so much fan art, guys. I apologize. <laughs> and we're just pretty cool. We're pretty cool. Yeah. Looks around hey, the group. Oh, I get the fan art. <laughs> <laughs> hey, gang, what's this? <laughs> you can replace that no. fucking paper with anything. Anything. Yeah. Anything. <laughs> you, sir, like, you guys do a lot of, like, no. you never... You do these explanations when I ask you things in character, where you never actually really go into detail <laughs> what's going on. Well, they so don't, you just give they, me the free reign to just keep yeah, doing well, these I, I think part of it is just like, they're like, we're not meant to be a parent. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, this one's from Mango Juice. It's simply labeled a face of a man who's about to explode. <laughs> that is horrible. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, <laughs> yo, Woo. shredding it, Sick, dude. Yeah. That's me. It's me shredding. We love oh. <laughs> freaking mm. awesome. <laughs> oh, like a little like food in your mouth. Hungry. Yeah. He's like an alien baby. I was born eight minutes to 27 seconds ago. <laughs> He's kind of cute. Look at him. Look at his eyes. Head empty, no thoughts, brain empty, vacant stare, consumed flesh of fleshy ones. Look into Look them. them. I see a soul in I there. I see a soul there. <laughs> I hunger, father. When can we assimilate the fleshy ones? Soon, child. Soon. Uh, 
we got a uh, Zach, who's one of our new oh, fan cute. artists, have been Whoa! making these Yay! lovely, lovely versions of all our Get characters. So Aww. good. That's so good. <laughs> That looks awesome. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <my shit. laughs> That's fucking good. Hey, yeah, yo. I like it. Hey, yo. <laughs> uh, yo. Look at that meat. Look at that meat. <laughs> that meat kind of looked like slime. I love face. Yeah. Show it again. <laughs> she going for it. Oh, boy. People do love the slimy boy. He's pretty cool. People do like the boy. Oh, Ooh, I love wow. Zuck. Oh, look at all this. Aww. He that's awesome. Hey, Toots. Hey, Toots. Oh, that's so cute. Golly. 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 <laughs> Golly. <laughs> this is so good. Actual, actual <laughs> word. <laughs> Uh, I make things. Rusted fan artist Junker is very happy that we have an artificer in all the parties. So Hell far. yeah! Do we? Uh, yep. Every every party has an artificer. It is. Look at, look at this garbage I made. Mm, yes, yes. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Looks like my survival oh. instinct is kicking in. Golly. <laughs> wow. Oh, that was oh is shit! This even like five levels or? <laughs> Maybe. My gosh. I mean, session. When's session three? Well, I guess we'll find out. Mm. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, He's so cute. Venom coming oh! back. <laughs> oh, That's no. awesome. I love it. He's hungry. Here's to phase three. Thank you so much, Junker. Oh, collaboration. Oh, wow. Collaboration. I like the, that every group and every campaign has a different feel right now it's uh yeah. i especially enjoy that yeah. yeah i'm are they in a forest those other ones which ones this uh yes they're, they're they're currently in a forest floating above the sky this one is a detective campaign and then of course you guys have a burned down bar <laughs> what, well, ours seems a little <laughs> bit weird. <laughs> Man, that was my favorite bar. <laughs> Why do we have hands? There are many reasons. Pat the home. Oh. Cherish the home. Oh. Hold the home. Oh. Forfeit all miracle <laughs> positions to the home. Oh. Uh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> I love these. Oh, I love these. Oh, sweaters. <laughs> Twits and golly. <laughs> Aww. Don't let any of this distract so you from cute. the fact that currently my character does believe he's entitled to eventually eating <laughs> no, That's adorable. Not. That's absolutely adorable. You ripped. Damn, you got so shredded. Ripped. What the heck? That's so cool. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at my butt. It's tight. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. Uh, oh, that's kind hey, of creepy. My first afraid. fan art that I have ever done. I don't know why, but I had the biblical accurate angels in mind for the first time I saw it and heard them. That is some yeah. creepy pasta, dude. Yeah, yep. definitely got biblical angel. From yep. <laughs> what are taxes? What are taxes? <laughs> this one's just labeled uh, lol, he's dead. And then there's oh. a little bomb. <laughs> yeah. Oh, gosh. Yeah. High speed projectile uh, raccoon. <laughs> oh, you look so badass. I'm just like in the background. Like, look at that. Ooh. I see a slime back there. Yep. Oh my God. Is that Clurtmart on a fucking billboard back there? Yeah. <laughs> was that Clurtmart, Brett? You said it was. It sure, sure was. Like you were, like sure. You were trying to avoid it. <laughs> <laughs> Buy our Buy shit. Our shit. <laughs> <laughs> Buy our shit. Ooh. Aww. I like animation. <laughs> oh my god. He gets two hats. Oh no. But why? But why? Love <laughs> trust. <laughs> Chalk blocks main character, entertaining quirky character who ruins the mood. Oh my god. Samantha! Yeah, you moved on past Samantha pretty quick today. Yeah. Here's the finished goo. She just gave good high fives, man. Oh, cool. With the That's shirt, so too. Good. Oh. Man, there's so many fan arts. Oh, buddy. Oh, <gasps> buddy. Oh! Ah. 
I did is, not think it was gonna be acid. Is this Aww. good? That's <laughs> chunky boy version. Yeah, that's sword. good, buddy. That's good. It's post alcohol bomb version. <laughs> I'm having I'm a breakdown. Having a so I'm digging a hole, diggy diggy hole. Oh no. <laughs> This is uh, this, there's a lot happening here. Oh, Claret no. Mart special tasty sauce. Limited no. edition. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, so much art today. Crazy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's with uh, <laughs> it's my disguise, <laughs> but I can see your face. Not when I do this, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Stop you guys are perfect. <laughs> They tell me I'm the bomb. I think that's a good thing. Aww. Aww. What is happening? <laughs> oh no. That's how I envisioned it going in my head. Like I thought you would allow it. So I'd just be like floating in your belly. I don't think the acidic juices are allowing or misallowing things. Yep. Right on, nice. Right on. <laughs> right on. My interpretation of the void bear. Oh my God, look at this. Oh, oh wow. wow. That's scary as fuck. Hey, now I don't feel so good about this fight. Uh, Dude, that feels so good. <laughs> yo! Yo! Oh, Zug. Yo! <laughs> good enough, man. <laughs> hey, good man. Enough. <laughs> if you see this man, everything is oh, fine. Do not report it to the local authorities. Have a good day. Oh, my God. Aww. That's good. That's good. Look me in the eyes. Do you feel it? The madness consuming your mind, the utter despair in madness. the face of the inevitable. Oh my god. Also, he baby. He just a little baby. Oh, oh look <laughs> at him! A little guy. Googly eye slime man. <laughs> You're the bomb, Claude. <laughs> 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 Aww. You're the bomb man. <laughs> B -b -b -bear. Bear. Oh, this oh, is really cursed good. as fuck. <laughs> oh god. I love it. I love it. Good. We got a bunch of new fan artists here. I love it. Dang, Damn. what is happening? <laughs> wow. An alcohol slide. Alcohol slide. He's thirsty. Really All right. good. All right, that ends our fan art you can section. Also, yes. If you want to, you can show the full art of I my can. character. I can. Yeah, let me go and show you. Oh yeah, me too. Yeah. I'm wearing Tim's, but nobody knows. Oh, <laughs> I, I haven't. I didn't. It wasn't ready for session one, but we got to show yeah. all of our full did, art. Yeah, I was like, did I not show uh, everyone's uh, art? No, it's okay. Session? I'll resend you mine. No, let me, let me, yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's go ahead and get everyone's art in here. Look at this boy. Zug. Look Hello. at that. Oh, wow. Yeah, Dang, that's amazing. Look at, Damn. The, look at the detail of this boy. I made that. Yeah. <laughs> that's my armor. It's so yeah, think, good. Yeah, it looks really good. And then, uh,. Fucking Juniper, I made this smile. Look at this art. God <laughs> damn. I got the Tims, baby. <laughs> <laughs> very so good. Very good. Uh, let me. I actually got everyone's art in a folder. Mm. Got that. Hey, Brad, got... I yes. got something that I can send to you, but you cannot show the chat. You can just react to it. <gasps> just you. Okay. okay. Can I? Uh, I'll, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm gonna I can send it. I'll, I'm gonna post you. your your full art as well. This well, you've so already cute. showed it, so yeah. There's Bo. This is this is secret art that people I will cannot. Uh, I'm gonna take a look at. <laughs> 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 Uh -huh. <laughs> All right, <laughs> you got it. That is ultimately sacred art. I see it now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Secret cursed forbidden art. This is uh -huh. goddamn. Uh, Shane, let me. I'm trying to. For some reason, I don't have your. I think it's because you gave me different token art. Oh yeah. Can you post? I have. Yeah, I could just. Yeah, repost. Repost, buddy. Where's my D and D folder? Uh, for now, though, I, I can post uh, this art, which is the boy. Look at the boy. Here comes the boy. Uh, so 
And then I'm looking for Shane's real quick. Oh, oh yeah, I, I got gotcha. you. I, I see it. Did I, I see pulled the full one? Oh, yeah, yes, there it is. Yes, you did. My downloads. Yes, you did. Look there he is. Look at yeah. this lad. Okay. Whoa, dude. Brass knuckles this on his sword. Look, yeah. at, look at this detailed boy. Oh, my God. Well, fan artist, now you got some reference points if, for, for next week. Yeah. Um, all right. Yeah, well, guys, thank you so much. That was an absolute delight of a session. It was it so was much amazing. fun using you guys. And... We will uh, continue next week. I think what we're gonna do, um, just so I know what you guys are gonna do, um, because we didn't get to it. Uh, the session was going to end on a bit of a, now what do you do? And that's essentially what part are you guys gonna get for this ship that you're building? And there is, you can essentially go all around the map to figure it, to go to the place that you wanna go to get the part or to look into a thing or to do that. So I wanted to ask what direction you guys want to go to, but you're in the middle of a bear fight right now. So I'll, I'll send you guys a message via via uh, Discord. And let me know which direction you guys want to go in with session three after after the bear fight. And then we'll go from there, okay? Hell yeah. Okay. I got okay. it. So let's find that propulsion shard, gang. Yeah, I yeah. wish I had any leads on that. <laughs> yeah, wish we had <laughs> some leads on that. Yeah, that'd be uh, interesting. Anyways, I'll see you guys uh, next <laughs> week, okay? <laughs> All right. See you then. Bye. Bye, Bye. guys. Bye. That was a good sesh. I was, I was, honestly, I was, I was worried I wasn't going to have enough content for you guys this week with Pipe Dreamers, and we had a shit ton of content with Pipe Dreamers, so I'm very excited about that. I'm really happy how well that got. Did you guys enjoy yourself? I, uh, I vibed. I really fucking vibed today. I'm, I'm so glad. I, uh, I, I thought the session went very well from a, from a comfort standpoint. And I've been fighting some wicked anxiety recently with uh, with the new D and D sessions. I don't know where it's coming from, but it's been challenging. I'm gonna be real with y'all. It has been mentally challenging to DM these sessions. So and it's nothing uh, anyone's done. Nothing like that. It just for some reason I'm just like <sighs> new new campaign, new session, new 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 phase, new everything, and it's just ex it's just I'm 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 wired. I'm freaking the fuck out. So I but it is uh. This session was really fucking good, so I'm feeling I'm feeling all right. Next, there's next week. Uh, we got D and D is normal, and then the week after uh, is actually my first uh, week break from from D and D, and that's gonna be really fucking awesome to just reset, catch up, and all that fun shit. But yeah, it's been uh, it's, it, it's been really good. It's been really good. It's okay, you a pro it like that. Well, I appreciate that, but also I don't want to get comfy slash. I don't, don't, don't want to be lazy with it. I don't want to be lazy with it. I don't want to be comfy with it. I want them to keep improving, you know. So, it's it's trying a bunch of new stuff, doing a bunch of fun shit. And yeah, it's been good. Uh, let me go and thank some subs. Uh, well, we'll thank some subs at the end. Um, I do want to let you guys know we have a Patreon. Head on over to the Patreon. Show us the secret, aren't you coward? Uh, no, I'm not going to show you. I was told not to show it and thus will not show it. Uh, go over our Patreon, World of IO, uh, patreon.com slash World of IO. Uh, we've been posting custom music. Uh, we've been posting a bunch of, uh, yeah, just a bunch of cool stuff. I'm going to be posting some 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 racial stuff on there real, uh, real soon. And uh, as well as encounters, all sorts of shit. So make sure you, you hop on over there. We've got early access uh, to music that's just been posted. The IO main theme is currently up on the Patreon, including a high quality loop that you guys can include on your Foundry or VTT. It works in Foundry. I don't know about other VTTs, but it loops perfectly. So uh, go ahead and check that out. Consider supporting. Uh, if you want to join our lovely little community, we've got a Discord uh, where we talk about IO and all sorts of stuff. Uh, between the sessions head on over to the discord if this is your first time watching an io campaign welcome we've got a youtube channel with i don't even i bro i don't even know how many sessions we've got it's over 200 um but we've got a uh, phase two uh all of phase two done if you're looking for some dnd &D to, to watch and uh we're uploading phase three sessions uh now uh typically two days uh after two days after stream so uh, be sure to check it out. Uh, so uh, Pipe Dreamers is actually going to be up 
on Sunday because usually it's dead beats on Saturday. Um, but we didn't do dead beats today, but I don't want to, I don't want to funk around with the upload schedule. So pipe dreamers is still going to be up on Sunday. So make sure you go Sunday, 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 go ahead and check that out. So this time it'll be three days ahead, but yeah, go ahead and check that out. Um, and then finally, every, a lot of people who subscribed, thank you so much. We're trying to get to 1500 subs. If we get to 1500 subs, we're going to do a D and D encounter stream where we're actually going to build a D and D encounter uh live on twitch together with input of chat uh and yeah it'll be a good educational experience for our fellow dm so uh, go ahead and uh go ahead and go over there and check